So, welcome back, everybody. We are continuing uh, Pizza Poo uh, featuring Hypocrite? Whoa. Me? Is this for me? They made this for me. So, last we left off, we uh, <laughs> made some serious progress, but we got stuck on a boss that I found so incredibly unfun. It literally was like killing the mood for me. I, was, I wasn't having a fun time. I was also just kind of in a bad mood, but we got her. We got it. And then the, the fucking hotel got under attack. The alchemist came out from uh, under the ground, I guess, and then uh, trashed the place, made fun of us, called us ugly, and then uh, basically harassed everybody. And look at this. Look at this fucking mess. Um, so now all of the alchemists scurried back down to their underground lair where all the mischief is happening. And apparently I think they forgot to close the back door because now... We have the secret passage below the hotel, um, and we're gonna go to the source of the problem, all right, and see what the fuck is going on. See if we can fib our way even harder with these pantaloons, um, and uh, see if we can uh, get this hotel back to the five stars that it used to be. Right now, it's uh, not doing very poorly on Yelp. Uh, so let's do it. Last, um, I guess, like prior to going live, I did uh, run back and do some basic upgrades with my build. In this case, we've we've moved away from the boss weapon and we're using uh, the saw with the with the little sword uh, handle hilt, and it's uh, working out pretty well. And it's a uh, buffed up all the way now. And I also solved a riddle and got an extra key. So uh, yeah, we got some stuff on the side, and uh, let's go. Let's go to the deep ground underneath the hotel and get these bitches. Okay, we already rode the hotel, so we can just teleport there now. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. And here, oh yeah, Vingini. I have to talk to Vingini, just kidding. <clears throat> Vingini, what is it? Thank you for another timely rescue, companion. Yeah, I yeah. Myself once again in your debt. Debt? For a billionaire? That's kind of normal, actually. That only I, in all my genius, can contribute. But if there is not, then Vingini is here to help you in any way he can. Fear not. Okay. Ah, looks like you've dealt with the puppets menacing the hotel steps in your typically dashing style. Yeah, yeah, I did kill people, uh-huh. enough readings to analyze. Mm hmm The king of puppets used carefully measured ergo wavelengths to control other puppets. But that's just the means to an end. We still don't know if the frenzy arose by the king of puppets, or if someone else is pulling the strings. <gasps> No pun he said pulling the strings like a puppet. Oh my god. I must yeah, that's good writing. Way to prevent puppets from hurting any more humans. The tragedy of Arlecchino must remain a one. His records are like a puzzle wrapped in riddles. But I always did love puzzles. <laughs> the light shines brightest in the darkest times, and you will be the first light. I am counting on you. All right, Italian Bruce Wayne, whatever you say. Okay, yeah, no, I'm good, I'm good. All right, that's a spiel, I guess. Uh, hold up, let me... Been following uh, along with YouTube VODs and glad you are enjoying my personal game of the year. If you don't get it, uh, you should totes look up the bad ending and can't wait for the post-credit reaction. I'm excited to see how this ends. I've heard good things about the ending, or it's just like, you know, it gets very, very cool, very, very cash money epic. I don't know. Um, all right. Okay, that's been... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanted to see if I was going crazy and saw that this, like, room had been open. I can't remember if this is something that I'd already opened before. I think I've already opened... Yeah, yeah, this is like a passageway to something else, unless... Wait, has this been open? I'm pretty sure this was open before, and it was like a connecting to somewhere else, and it connects to like the line or something. Hold on. Gotta go to bed, y'all. Gotta get early tomorrow, but okay, RJ, thank you so much for being amazing, and uh... Congratulations on being that top bun, baby. Hope you have a good night. Pretty sure I've already been here. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, I'll just make- I'm trying to- I can't fucking remember. Yeah, we've already been here. Okay. Alright. Just check him. I'm getting the fuck out of here. And back we go. Gotta admit, this, got, this game's got some nice door opening animations. They know how to make a sexy door open. Yeah, we took the office paper cutter blade and glued it onto the sword hilt. Yeah, just like, uh... Just like Mithrigan did in that, you know, when she did the funny dance and she killed the guy. That's kind of what we're wielding right now. We're, this is very Megan core. Have you gotten any favorite music records that you found in this game yet? I mean, so far, all of the ones that we've listened to have been kind of bangers. I think we've only gotten like four of them. 
I intend to do a second playthrough and be a lot more, um, I guess, diligent with collecting things. First playthroughs, I'm always just like, you know, the vibes. We just kind of go with what we got. Um, but, uh, yeah, the music's nice. Uh, I, like, you know, considering, uh, there's not a lot of, like, music being played throughout the game. It's a lot of ambiance and, like, the boss music. Um, it's a nice, it's a good amount of variety. It's like, shit, they, so they spent a lot of time, you know, banging out these, these bangers, I guess. <laughs> and, uh... Uh, giving you a chance to really just, like, you know, appreciate it. All right, let's go. Deep down to the underground. Relics of the whatever the fuck that is entrance. Let's go. So thank you for the 33 months. Welcome on back with the beautiful 33 with the dumpies. Also, yes, guys. Twitch changed their terms of service with um, artistic nudity and twerking and pole dancing and a few other things are technically allowed now for streamers. So I assume that, hey, that must be applied to emotes as well. So I've re-uploaded my dumpy that was banned like two years ago for sexual content, quote unquote, because um, I guess it looks too much like a boob throwing it back. And uh, we're trying our luck. Let's see if Twitch bans it. If they do, I'm going to be kind of peeved because it's like, oh, so you can throw ass in real life, but you draw the line at my fucking buns. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, yeah, fingers crossed. <laughs> Let's hope they don't notice it because KT's gotten away with having his dumpy the whole time. I, I you know, I, 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 I maybe I changed I changed the prefix to something that maybe won't get flagged. I don't know. We're going to try. Okay. Yeah, this area is looking very code veiny. It's this is giving code vein all the way. Um, and, uh, not, not like a bad thing. It's just like, you know, with all the creepy-ass crystals popping through the ground, it's giving code vein. Um, I feel like I can drop down. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah. Here's, here's water. See, I've been waiting for a whale to show up in this game, because, like, you can't really have Pinocchio without a whale. Um, and yet no monstro. Like, what is this, you know? Up. Oh. This was so I'm waiting for a whale to show up in some capacity. Is, is this the relic of Tris Gazoon type. I think I've been here before. Uh, maybe I haven't gotten all my memories back after all. What are you not telling us, Jiminy? What's going on? Someone was dragged away from here. We have to follow. Hurry. I guess he's thinking of the 100. Uh, interesting on what your thoughts are for the IGN ranking article for the best Souls like of the year, especially if you play Wulong. I played all of the ones listed, and I don't agree with the ranking. Wulong and Remnant 2 are my favorites. I went to the fall in 2003, and Lies of P were not. Really? I, have, I, I saw the article. I didn't read it. Like, you know, I just saw, like, the, the preview of it and stuff. But I haven't played all the Souls likes of the year. This is literally the only one. <laughs> like, I played the tutorial of Wulong, and then I just, like, got tired. So I never, you know, never got all the way in. Ooh, sealed underground. Spooky. I guess she's thinking for the hundred, though. Yeah, I gotta go over the list, though. I don't know. I think, like, this game is pretty fucking solid, but, like... Then again... I, I'm, I'm, I'm a big, I'm a big uh, art design atmosphere person. I'm all about, like, ooh, look at that shortcut. You know what I'm saying? Trismegismus means thrice according to Genshin. It's it's quite the mouthful, and I'm definitely gonna get my eyes crossed reading it. <laughs> also, it's dark as fuck in here. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna turn on my little Jiminy lighting. I just realized I've had this the entire time. I could've, hold on. There we go. Uh-oh, hey! My butterfly ass is dead. Whoa, that's a lot of boys! This is a lot of butter. Oh my god. That's flying. Full moon. Oh. Full moonstone of the cup. Hey, I kind of need one of those. I've been waiting for this upgrade, I think, for the uh, the, the final boss. Or, like, my, my boss weapon final form. Excuse me. Um. Okay, this looks like a little path. Yeah, butter for your buns? I guess a little bit. The will shows up. We have to pay uh, $20 to unlock the last area of the game. Not the DLC. Oh. Boy, which I probably would like to play. Hmm. Sup, Mama? Okay, now we got. Woo! Oh, we have traps. Oh, God. Okay. Keep an eye on the ground. I don't trust this shit. Yeah, this weapon's fucking sick, honestly. Woo! 
It's all about that fast swing with that big, sw you know, uh, hitbox. You know what I'm saying? The, uh, that's a that's a pressure plate. I know this. It's like we got bear traps, pressure plates, mud, the works. Star fragment. Thank you. Okay. Making my way downtown. As you touch the butterfly, your peepee -pee is restored. <laughs> Oh, my power is coming back to me all the way down. Oh my god, speaking of pee pee. Okay, Anya and I, we saw Salt Burn, uh, which is, again, I, I can't remember the movie, who made it or whatever. Um, but uh, it's, it, it is a movie. Um, and uh, I, I don't want to spoil it, but is it is just about a weird little guy doing weird little things to a, fa a family of rich people. And it's a, it was a time. Had a lot of pee had a lot of pee pee. Had a lot of sipping on stuff and uh, yeah. Oh the tub seat! Yeah, it was a it was a piece of I mean Ani and I keep talking about it, but yeah, I don't want to spoil it, because I think the less you know the better. But if you've ever seen that actor and you're like, he normally plays kind of weird little dudes, he does indeed play weird little dudes in this movie. Also, this is a big bitch. Oh god, excuse me. Oh, I died. Oh shit. Okay, I can't. I can't be talking about salt burns and what's his face uh, doing being a little, weird little guy on screen. Hold on. What movie again? Salt burn, or is it salt burns? Let me look it up. Oh, okay. Yeah, salt burn. Excuse me. It, it's a movie from this year, and it features. Uh, what's his name? Barry. Kogan, as I say his name? He's always playing a weird little guy in movies, and I thought this would be like the exception. No, he's playing a weird little guy again. <laughs> Doing weird little guy things. It was very beautiful. I just thought it could have been edited better. So, you know, as an editor. But... I'm gonna tell my partner I want to watch it, not tell him what it's about. <laughs> Uh, Keegan, Keegan, thank you. Yeah, yeah. I, I like, I know I've seen other things that he's been in, like, a uh, killing of a sacred deer and things like that. And I seriously thought that this like this role would be a little different for him where he's not going to be playing a weird little guy doing weird guy things, but I was very wrong by the end of it. So Is that what you call typecasting? Yeah. Now, I like we enjoyed it cuz Annie and I kept talking about it after. Um I wouldn't say it's like, you know, the most uh, like amazing film I've ever seen, but I I it did it did leave an impression, so It's also got what's her face from Gone Girl. It's got Gone Girl from Gone Girl. Okay, yeah, all right. Big bitch alert. Here we go. Woo! Okay, that knocked me backwards. Oh, that oh, that also knocked me. Hey, why can't we just talk this out, my guy? He is really chunky. Oh, there we go. Woo! Oh, that's a, ooh, that's a combo. Man, he's tough. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm a little rusty. Bear with me, fellas. I want to beat his ass, but something tells me he respawns. Weird little guy doing weird little things in that guy. No, Clems is very normal. I could attest to that. Sometimes. <laughs> the Clems is the best. Sir is comboing, yeah, and I'm I'm getting comboed down. Mario and Princess Beach be in the Death Stranding movie. Mario and Princess Beach be in the Death Stranding. Oh, it better be. It better fucking be. Whoa, what the play Santu at my work, I'll play some Santu. Oh my, that's a ho 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 one out here. Oh my god. We with the Twitch bits to donate with. Dragon Warrior oh baby. Dragon Warrior with the two. Wow. Th thank you so much for the 2000. And then some with the Twitch on the side. Thank you. I am feeling the, I am feeling the Christmas spirit in this chilies tonight. Thank you. 
Dragon, congratulations once again on being that big bit and blessing me. Alright, now let's see if I can use the power of Santa Claus to get this guy. Oh, hold on. Let me see. Ah, I don't like that little delay. The death animation people, I'm sure, had fun. It's like, let's just have him plank over. He just goes limp and just flat, you know, falls right on his face. What if I have an idea? I have an idea. I have an idea. Really? What is it? Let's leave. I, I know when I'm outmatched, okay? We're going to run past and we're going to RPG our way out of that one when I come back and I'm stronger and then I kick his ass. He's got some, like, I can block that first one, but his, uh, his, normally his second swing's a little delayed, and it's a little awkward. Yeah, time to book it. Time to hit the pantaloons power. Excuse me. Ugly. Thank you. Oh, God. Okay, I see, I see. Oh, he's gonna kick my butt. stupid i would have guys if i was a if i was a rat i would instantly die from a fucking uh mouse trap i'd be like ooh, piece of cheese <laughs> i can't believe they just leave these things out mm, num 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 dead also hello bumby I, I am bad at this game i am i'm not i'm not assessing my environment properly How many times do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? Gosh. Hi, Bombi. Guys, don't forget to follow fishing rules. Fishing rule streams are back. I'm guessing it's behind him. Does the thing stay open? It does. Oh, that's a nice detail. Hey, hey. Oh, it's a, it's a cursed night halberd? That's sexy. Let's walk past. Walk this way. Excuse me. Bye-bye. Stinky. Let's see how long he trails me. Oh, God. Okay, ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Hold on. Please don't. Yep. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. He's following me. I have no choice. He's gonna kick my butt! I love that, you know, at this point, we've come full circle where it's like we're near the end of the game and we're getting, like, default enemies again. It's like, these are, these are basic bitch puppets. That's how you know you're reaching the end of the game when the base enemies come back, but they're stronger. Okay, is this all right? That's not a knockdown, not yet. Ah, shit! Speaking of which, and I gotta keep an eye on the floor. This place is fucking trapped. Uh, let's see. A small soundboard suggestion is a soundbite of, uh, I believe Miller from Dance Moms going, YOU DESERVE NOTHING! <laughs> also, I almost died. Hold on. Whoops. Honestly, yeah, I should. That woman is insane, but she's- damn, does she have some quotable lines. I love that video of, like, that, uh, that other Dance Mom confronting her when she's, like, eating, I think, in her wheelchair in the middle of a pageant, and then she just, like, slowly backs away from- you know, in this wheelchair, and then just starts bolting down the street, and the cameraman can't keep up with her, because she was, like, so offended that someone called her out. <laughs> but she just left. Okay, this is a big bitch. Ah, shit. God damn it. Oh, I almost finished that swing. Come on, come on. There we go. Yahoo! Got it. All right. 
Oh yeah, she was on the phone. Yeah, I can't remember what she was doing, but like she got confronted by another dance mom, and she just slowly. It's like you couldn't write something like it's just, like the comedic timing of something like that, and just how extra she is as a person is so funny. Like, obviously, I don't appreciate how much she's traumatized kids in her career and, like, screamed at them and belittled them. You know, she can burn in hell for all I care, but it's like, she is great TV, you gotta admit, you know? <laughs> also, that seems like, that seems like a specter dish and a boss. Let's see if we can find a shortcut, yeah? Um, let's see here. She couldn't handle someone causing her to, to introspect to how much of a piece of crap she is. Yeah. Let's see here. All right, we're going back up. Yeah, see, I want to answer the phone. Ring a ding ding, baby. Okay, I guess we don't really need a shortcut shortcut for this because it's not that far. Let's see. Another, another, another riddle head scratcher for the jokester. Also, random night. Thank you so much for being, uh, for gifting the sub to Twitch. Also, Isaac, thank you so much for the 60 months saying, oh, Liza P. And dare I say, poo? Yes, yes, indeed. And we have to keep running. I knew that you would, and I find that refreshing. Okay, I have to confess, I do know the answer to this one because I came across one of the phones off stream and I just looked it up because I didn't want to fuck up, so I know the answer. Blind confessions. Sorry, guys. Immersion ruined. Blind playthrough over. Me? <laughs> Little old me? <laughs> Who wants to talk about murders? The spilling of blood is kind of a straightforward one. I don't even think I needed the guide to know that, but hey, I looked up the other one just to be safe. Damn, that's 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 very pretentious deep, but sure. Isn't that just so human? You're going the distance. Fucking love that song from Hercules, thank you. Here's your teeth. I hope you enjoyed our time, second film. But for now, that's farewell from the king Thanks, babe. Get better material. All right. Yeah, is murder even a thing in a post-apocalyptic society where you are basically no laws or enforcement? Well, it's like, and also eat, kill or be killed, you know? You're just like raw survival instincts at this point. It's like, is it? I would say a lot of this constitute is self-defense since because I'm not exactly swinging out here aimlessly. I'm being attacked, you know? Mine's like the handful of other people that we actually killed, but whatever, whatever. Don't worry about it. All right, let's see if I can find a shortcut before I do that. If there is one, I don't think there is. From the looks of it here. Actually, I don't think there is one. Okay, let's, let's try our luck. Let's see what this boss is all about. You guys ready? All right. Yeah, another key. I wonder what we'll find. I gotta find the door. Gotta get the door. Okay. Oh. Oh, what in the Shimigami Tensei? I don't- I don't like coffins be standing out and looking at me. Okay. Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll bring in the Spectre in the second attempt. Let's see what this thing's got going on. Oh, boy. It is I. Pantaloons. Oh, it's the rabbit. It's John Rabbitson. Oh, God. It's the furries! Oh, it's their back! They're fucking back! The boys are back in town! They're gonna kick my butt! 
What the fuck they put on that thing? Is that a bomb attached to it? Fight. Death has come for you. Oh, we're gonna need some backup on this. Absolutely. Okay, they're gonna kick my ass. Get ready, guys. Oh, oh, it's giving shadows of Yarnum. No, thank you. You know, I don't think they need to put the Black Brotherhood for each fucking title. You know, I think we get it. I think I think we get who they're. Okay, whatever. All right, at least they take their time kicking my ass. Something to, okay, their health is going down very easily and they're not attacking me. There's definitely a second phase and it has to do with that thing opening up. Calling it now. I saw I'm electric shock. Ow. Woo! Okay. Yeah, I'm totes dead. Let's just see what they do here. I do appreciate that they took they take their time beating me up, you know? <laughs> Don't gangbang me all at once, guys. Take me to dinner first. Also, I can barely see because their fucking health bars and my status effects are fucking stacking. <laughs> oh my what in the fucking that was a Bloodborne move. Woo! Okay. Oh. Okay. Hey! 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 Watch it. Okay. Yep. Yeah, that's a. I'm gonna die. Hold on. Let's reset. Thank you. All right. I get it. I get it. You'll kick my butt. Can we make the health bar smaller, please? I can't see myself. Yeah, Maria, looking ass out here. I've seen that move before. <laughs> Did you know they're part of the Black Rabbit Brotherhood, TM? Yeah. Also, is there a way to shrink their fucking... Hold on. HUD. I want to see... Small, yeah, small camera, graphics. Is there a way to reduce it? No, I guess not. The developers really took a page out of every Souls from soft game hunting. Not enough. Just impressive how they put such a... Pain. Yeah, no, it, uh, definitely wearing the inspiration on its sleeve for sure, but I think it's fresh enough, you know? Yeah, I'm having fun. Isaac, thank you so much for the 100. Also, they understand the basic rule of, uh, and not that, like, other FromSofts don't follow this, and, but it's just, like, it's very apparent that you need to follow this, is that when it's, you know, assumed to be a 1v3, you should have it to where they're, you know, only attacking you individually at a given time. Um, just so you're not overwhelmed immediately. Uh, and, they, you know, they're pretty generous with that. Like, at no point are you, like, really only getting attacked more than twice uh, at a time. Um, and that's only if in your proximity. So, yeah, winnable. Let me just get some, some fucking help in here. I would like to use my phone call now to get my lifeline. All right, and break through the door. Hey, ugly. Hey, stupid. What's up? 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 Come and get these pantaloons. Bye. Oh! <laughs> Okay, bye. I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. That's what's up. God, be knocking me upside the fucking head. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna jump down. Wee. Hey, it's big boy. Hey, it's bye bye. Oh shit, where is it? Hold on, it's over here. There we go. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's you're you're ugly. Bye bye. Thank God they don't follow me past here. Okay, now I guess while well, I oh I don't even have all my ambulance on. My amulets. I forgot I unlocked another roll. Um has a chance of numb being consumed and using a pulse out. That's kinda useful. Hmm, actually yeah, that. That's better. Okay, hold on. And let's do Let's get the cube in here. Oh, I forgot to change it at the thing. Damn. Okay, it's fine. No cube for now. We'll do it for the second attempt. Let's see what we got going on. And let's do a fire one. Actually, let's do a lightning one because we only have so much. I need to get more put shots. I think I'm out of them. Yeah, I'm totes out. All right. Going with what we got. Not a lot because I used a lot of my throwables on that one boss I got stuck on for fucking ever. Um. Oh. A small tip for this fight, after you kill one, you might want to get the last dude close to the same health before it Noted, I see, I see, wink, I see what you're getting at. 
Yeah, if snakes burst out of their chest, that's the from soft use for sure. The swing on this is so sexy. I love it. Oh, they're, oh, no, they're kicking his butt. Okay, all right, hold on. Okay, okay, that's one. That, that, that's low enough for now. Let's get you. Let's get you, little missy. Ah! Woo, too much is happening. Too much! Ooh, backstab. Don't mind if I do. Okay, hold on. Mama, I don't want to have to kill you. Okay, I got to get your dumbass brother now. Hold on. Hang tight. Who's gonna die first? You! Oh, I think this is pretty damn good. Hold on. Did we win? You! Okay. Yeah, big boy! Oh, I, oh, I should've used my cube, y'all. Okay. Alright, now it's just us. Holy shit. That's a fucking combo, baby. Damn it. No! God, shit! Okay. I see. I understand. All right. That's a lot. That's a lot. Okay. Oh, he's tired. Don't move! Don't move! One question, y'all. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Stop fucking lying. That was clean, right? That was that clean? I mean, it was a little messy. <laughs> I think for I think for a second attempt that wasn't bad for a second. <laughs> Thank you so much for that 50. You know what I say to this? 
Let's go, girls. I feel like a real woman now. Fuck these real boy hours. Woo! <laughs> Did somebody say slay? Did somebody say <laughs> slay? Oh, I thank you so much for that. 50. Holy cannoli. Thank you. Thank you. Once again, you are. That shit was perfect. I was really fucking worried. I thought after I lost all my, my healing, I was like, ooh, we're out of here. So, what the fuck was I wearing for this? In this case, upon a successful perfect guard, temporary increases damage inflicted by weapon attacks. That made the, all the difference here, okay? Fucking blocking my ass off. My Sekiro skills are finally paying off in this instance. Good lord. Got his ass. Whew. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> BP triumphs. <laughs> oh, thank God we don't have to like head back to the fucking blue fairy anymore. We can just level up right here. Holy shit, that felt good. Oh man, I rarely do well like th that well on most attempts. <laughs> and ah oh, man, shit's getting expensive now. All right, yeah, let's level up my health. You know what, Game Awards Sekiro style deflex Wulong Gar. I really should, honestly, and I have it. Like you know, at least I think it's still on Game Pass. I can't remember. Um, yeah, I like I'm, I've been on a Souls kick. I'm going back to my roots. Um, speaking of which, I'm going back to Red Lobster right now because you know I got to get more of those shot puts. Those things are awesome. Um, oh man, man, I didn't think I'd get that on that first, the second try. Basically, first try, first legitimate try. Because I always, you know me, I always try to do the first time just to see what they do, what kind of attack pattern they got going on, you know that kind of nonsense. Um, not bad. Red Lobster. Oh yeah, the cube. I gotta change my cube too. I gotta get my. I got apples before. That should be wild. How'd you be? In a, you you literally come out of like the sky and just slam the biggest fucking bunch of mun muns. New challenger. <laughs> ah. Holy. Challengers approach. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Nice work. Ah. Super sudden death. How'd you be in a with two hundred? Bitch, you be wild. <laughs> Let's dance. <laughs> A little less dance boys on the side. Let's dance boys. Ah! Woo! Kaiju Vita with the 200. Sandwiches for miles. <laughs> Ba da da, ba da da, ba da da, ba da ba da. <laughs> Guys, you beat up. Thank you so much. Scaring the bejeebas out of me. Oh my god. And like. <sighs> oh my. Just for me? The little old me? Oh my god. I wasn't shaking before. Good lord. Good lord. Guys, thank you so much. <laughs> Welcome back. Happy New Year, I guess. Happy Holiday. Happy fucking... Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Holy cannoli, that is... Good, great, awesome, amazing! Holy shit. I thank you. <laughs> you guys are so fucking sweet to me today. Um... Thank you so much. Congrats on being the top bun, baby. Unstoppable. Oh my. Oh fucking my. Huh. Look who's on top of the game. Thank you so much. Oh. God, congrats. Thank you guys. I feel like I'm kicking ass in the video game. You guys are kicking my ass. With the wads, with the fucking wads. 
Kai, thank you. And everybody too, guys, thank you. Holy shit. <laughs> Let's keep these good vibes going. <laughs> I did indeed, I broke her, oh dear. I'm a little, I'm a little goofy. Indeed. A little indeed busted. Thank you so much. Okay, what kind of fresh horrors we got waiting for us? Okay, honestly, be for real. I'm still I'm still riding the high of me actually getting this the second try. How long did you think this boss was gonna take me? Honestly, for people who've played this game before, like knew it was coming. Were you worried? Were you like, oh boy? Or no, were you not, would you like, ah, she's got this. Like, what, what was the read? What was the holding your breath? Huh. Oh. Yeah, second try. First try, I went in with like, you know, three healers. I just did it to see what their attack pattern was like. Second try, I went with the specter, but I, I got it second try, so. You've cracked when, I do cracked when focus. That is true. I do play way worse when I'm not focused. Like a lot of people. Uh, no, but like, so I, even guys, <laughs> You guys know I'm serious when I go nonverbal, um, but uh, I have been trying really hard to do that in this case where, uh, uh, you know, it's like, yeah, being funny, haha, -ha, in the midst of it is, you know, all, all good and stuff. But like, you know, I got to give these things my full attention and I got to go quiet. And when I do, shit gets real. But I did feel like saving you a couple hours. <laughs> I mean, that fucking mini boss we got stuck on was like sucking the life out of me. <gasps> Our dog friend. Oh, my God. Just don't kill me. What? No, I would never. You're my furry best friend. Oh. Amazing. I didn't expect you to thrash those rabbit fellows too. I'm more worried for you to future boss. I heard there's a harder future boss coming, so we'll the see what happens. and the cat have got that old man. They took the submarine from that dock over there. <gasps> they probably went to the The alchemist. submarine? There should be another one. You should commandeer it. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. I don't... This does not smell right. I'm just a guest here. With no special obligation that's to That's right, that's right. But if you still want to hear... <laughs> Let's investigate. Let's give him a fair hear. me escape from the city. Talk about an offer I couldn't refuse. I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to... Move up and move on. No! Also, there was someone who was so... Who annoyed. wouldn't want to live in a hotel? Did Home Alone 2 teach you nothing? Suffice? There should be something left at the dock. Right. I had a feeling you would ask sooner or later. It's because of that girl, isn't it? Yes. I am not Alidoro the Hound. Whoa. Not the real one, anyway. I used to be Alidoro's partner. Oh my god! To be honest. <laughs> he was amazing. Amazing at everything, except making a profit, that is. Oh, f okay, yeah, he's he dead. He's dead. Just because I sold some antiques. I mean, what's a few antiques when you've got bills to pay? Uh, 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 we argued. Okay, to be fair, I under, you know, you, when you got bills, true, but at the same time. But stealing his identity. Let's see them bills. Next step. My original code name is Parrot, after all. Fitting, isn't it? Pa parrot? He was also from the country of the morning. Maybe he shares some blood with the guy. That's my story. Okay, yeah, you're just a, you're like a super liar. Um, I didn't see anything. Should we get his ass? I, I, it seems like everybody's like, you know, square the fuck up, get his ass. Should we do it? I'm so ready. I got, I got my, I got my foot on the pedal. Kill. Buy from him? Oh yeah, yeah. Let's let's do any more oh, boss trading so. before we kill him. Yeah, get him for yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I think actually we're I'm out of boss souls at this point. So yeah, yeah. I don't think I can purchase anymore. I'm exhausted. The others, because I've either I've traded in the weapon or the amulet. Kill, kill, kill. Mega blast. All right, let's get his ass. Left oh, what a murderous air you have. Yep. You're going to kill me. I know what you are. Huh? Geppetto's puppet, aren't you? <laughs> I know what you are, yeah? You, you can't hurt them either. That limitation makes it seem like your creator didn't trust you very much. Smart of him. Oh. So, what will it be, Mr. Handsome Idiot? Leave quietly? The fuck you just call me? Shut up and buy something. The fuck you just call me? <laughs> Bitch! Like a human. Yes. 
things. <laughs> Little old me. <laughs> yeah, I'm human. He called me an idiot. Sorry, you had to die. You, also, you like, you know, betrayed everybody at the hotel and risked everybody's lives and, you know, have been impersonating your dead partner. That's a little wrong. Um, and uh, also, you know, the court system's not exactly functioning right now. So, hey, hey, it's me, judge, jury, and executioner in pantaloons. What are you going to do about it? All right. Let's see what he dropped. What was it, an amulet or? Increase weight limit. Oh, actually, hold on. That's a good idea. Oh, I'm, I'm wearing the weight limit one. Okay, hold on. Whoops. Uh, free chest? Yeah, what was it? I guess, hold on. Let's see here. He did call me handsome, which is not wrong. He has eyes. Ooh, great Vangini collection. Nice, nice, nice. The other dog dude replaces him as a special vendor. Yay! I love being able to kill people and get away with it. <laughs> What fun. All right, so we got down here and I guess, oh, okay, this is like the other side. Oh yeah, yeah, that's where I got the, the shit kicked out of me by what's his face, by the big guy. He dropped a cryptic box, gotcha. Also, I want to think of the uh, gifting a sub. Oh shit, thank you. Um, <laughs> the diesel punk oranges. Thank you so much for giving that eight months. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for being here, for being a lovely regular. It was a total attack. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood, the Fox, the Cat, and Aladoro too. And a little dog, too! I don't even want to guess what they might be planning, pal. This way must lead to their headquarters. Yeah, so some mischievous nonsense, that's for sure. What's well, time to get there? Let's see, let's take this submarine. Let's see if uh, Geppetto downloaded the submarine instructions. Oh my god, I'm sorry, I just looked over. Kai, again, Kai Jubino, thank you so much for that for that 200. And, uh, feeling... That, that was a donut with love all the way. Hey, look. That lever resembles... Yes, it seems we can use it to call a submarine. Oh, the Great Vangini submarine. Okay, hold on. Hang tight. Hold on. Y'all are invited to the launching ceremony of Vingini's company's new submarine, the Patris. Come and see the Pistris dashing Pistris, okay. <laughs> dashing dignity. Size 42.2 meters and whatever measurements. Displacement, uh, yeah. Speed above water 12 knots, underwater 7 knots. Uh, populous method, something engine and lead acid batteries out. Brain damage. The Pistris news with Mr. Vangini's newest emo motivity organ. A patent product named after Mr. Vangini, the new method that generates a the bigger electric output by electri electrically submitting ergo. Yeah. Supplementary power on top of that, it serves as a bar. Ballast at the bottom of the submarine, such as an innovation, to such an innovative design, the one time chance to take a peek into the future of Krat, the city of science, don't miss out. Come join us. Is what it sounds like. <laughs> All right, let me put my, put my, take my reading glasses off. There we go. Okay, let's get in this thing. Is this, is this a submarine call? Pull the lever, crunk! See, this game's got some great door opening animations and lever pulling animations. Electric stimulation. Eh. Holy shit! That thing's punch him. Now we're yeah, that's pack, and that's I guess that's as whale as we're gonna get for now. Yeah, does anyone know how to drive one of these bitches? <laughs> Why is that so 
funny. <laughs> Listen, pal. That's a fu that's a cool ass sub. Uh, with fucking <laughs> with water launching action. Hey, it's Sophia. <gasps> Literally yeets itself out of the fucking water. I am finally meeting you here. Ah! You're a clever one. So it shouldn't surprise you that the Sophia at the hotel isn't really me. <gasps> My real self is on the upper part of the Abbey. <gasps> I became his tool a long time ago. I knew it! I have endured such pain. My soul split into pieces. Truth is, I guided you this far not to save Cropped, but to save me. What? I felt guilty about that, but I was so elated when you answered my call. Despite it all, I thank you. My Mama, what kind of <laughs> body? Fair. Apart for I mean, a girl's got to do what she's got to do, but. For my love, you will feast this weekend. Lots of love and respect to you as always. In peace. In peace. Oh my God. Before my spirit diminishes further, Stargazer will guide you, clever one. Yeah. All right, Simon. Square up. All right. You, we got to rescue our girly pop, I guess. Help me find peace. My guidance ends here. Oh. After no. Our our magic milf. Oh shit! Are you are you gonna like turn in the fairy dust and get out of here or what? Damn. Okay, yeah, we're on fucking Magic Island. Let's go. Roscoe, thank you for the dollar. Saying hi, buns. Uh, here to hang out and lurk, but uh, while I bake a metric fuck ton of brownies for my larb uh, ye feast this weekend, lots of love and respect to you as well. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I hope I hope the I hope the cooking goes well. The brownie bacon. Damn. Oh yeah, the betrayal, deception. Disgrace. Seriously, the lady. You didn't. Th I mean, like, we knew she was sussy, that she was hiding something, that she was, like, not who she said she was. So she's literally a fucking ergo projection, and we need to find her body. And I'm guessing Simon's got it hooked up or whatever, because he's literally a tool, huh? We've been fucking played. Yeah, when does she set herself on fire for the ur tree? <laughs> when she got norted. Uh, she says you can even level up. Okay, cool. Yeah, I figured as much. It's like, oh my god, the reveal. I just love what she's like, fucking finally you got to the island so I can drop my big fat juicy secret. Anyway, please come rescue me. <laughs> We've been schmickledorfed. Okay, well this is turning into the ring city very fast. Um, this is a lot of open space. Okay, I guess we're somewhere up there. It's who knows. This is so funny. It's like, you know, like we could have achieved the same outcome with a boat, but instead, no, it's a fucking launching submarine shark. I kind of love that. I love the needless excessive creativity here. It's like not even <laughs> like there's no reason for it to be a sub. We don't go under at least we don't go underwater yet. I don't know. The game's not over yet, but I'm just like. It's a sub that fucking shoots itself to the water. You know, it could have just been like, could have been a little rowboat. I don't fucking know. Or a little speedboat, something. Okay, got the magic barrier out here. Also, yeah, hold on. Can I, can I, can I rest back to you? Are you stargazer? I can't. Let's talk. Yeah. I am the daughter of Valentinus, leader of the alchemists. Simon was my father's right hand man. Whoa! Ambition overwhelmed him, however. And he spread the petrification disease, taking countless lives. Why would he do that? I don't know. But he brings a dark world upon us. I don't know. He's got. He's so drunk with power, mad lad. Stop him. It's However, Simon's yeah. fault. Yeah, yeah. It's the bad guy's fault. Shit. I found someone else who has seen Lion King. To how can you? Like, it's a classic. See you later, agitator. What a great line. I love I love Lion King too. It's a good movie. Are we at the end of the final warrior fight for the Darkest Soul DLC area now? I'm already getting that. Yeah, no, this literally looks like the the 
final boss area in the Ring City DLC. It's literally just a field of ash. Obviously, it's a more beachy, a little more cool. It's uh, it's giving Kingdom Hearts 2 uh, ending vibes a little bit with these blue rocks. Kind of digging it. I know if you squint your eyes over there, you can see Riku and Sora having a real one. Um, yeah, this is, let's see how, let's see what this gives us. Also, let's, let's give a little more lore here, considering this girl's dropping truth bombs left and right. About the meaning of the tool. What do you mean? You're a tool of, okay. And memory within mm -hmm. the yeah, okay, okay, yeah. Ergo is the purified essence of that life, trapped by the petrification disease. When I discovered that, it opened my eyes. And I was able to manipulate time using Ergo. <gasps> yeah, opened your third eye. Uh -huh. On the other hand, is trying to use my power to fuel his ambition. Not, not ambition's gone away. You, so you could stand against him. So stop him. Save Krat. Or what's left of it, rather. Sure. Um. <laughs> Here's my controversial opinion. Lion King 1.5 or Lion King 1.5 is the best one. You would be actually correct. At least when it comes to like pure humor, I agree actually. I love Lion King 1.5. If you watch Lion King 1 and then Lion King 1.5, it's the funniest fucking thing you've ever seen. Um, you need to have very v vivid memory of how Lion King 1 plays out though, in my opinion. But uh, no, Lion King 1.5 is fucking great. Also, the opening song, the Raven Simone version of that, amazing. What a, what a fun time that was. That was back when, like, the, the direct-to-DVD movies were, like, legi legitimately good, <laughs> you know? I remember watching Lion King 1 and a half a lot with my little DVD that had, like, the little interactive mini-game. What in the Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep is this? What the- <laughs> Xehanort? <laughs> what are you doing up there? Oh my god! <laughs> When's the, the sky is gonna crack open with a heart. Oh my god. <laughs> Come closer. Oh my god. I can, I can hear the Come. already. Holy shit. We, he's about to summon Kingdom Hearts. Where the fuck is Aqua? Someone, oh my god, someone get a heated blanket. We got a Dethal Ven. What the fuck is going on over here? Oh, we're about to get revelations. Okay. We're about to find out I was a real boy and my soul isn't a puppet or some nonsense like that. Yeah. Hit, hit me with it, game. Give me those sweet revelations we've been building up to. I want to go home. I don't want to leave here. Tony sleeps till daddy's back. Ten sleeps. Twenty? Soon enough. You know he's quite busy. Papa. Romeo. <gasps> oh, ooh, we're getting chunks. Oh shit, we're getting memory chunks. Oh my god, this literally looks like look up Birth by Sleep, uh, uh or Kingdom Hearts, uh, the fucking Birth by Sleep teaser. You know what I'm saying? The secret ending. Page two, final mix, secret ending. Let's practice together. The Puppet King? That's Romeo. Yeah. Are we about to be sent to the realm of darkness to be forgotten about for 10 years? <laughs> yeah. We'll see what happens. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm looking off to make sure I'm not missing nothing. Okay, yeah. Wants me, wants me to follow the lore path. Let's go lore walking. I don't feel like I'm dressed for the occasion. I feel like I'm a little too silly to get all this serious lore. He didn't even come to your graduation. Bucket. Don't say that. It's nice you got any family at all. Too late. Bucket kicked. Let's start talking about this. Oh, she's here. Grab her. Grab her. Oh my god. Damn ergo. Man, we're yeah, we're getting fucking fed right now with the ergo bits. I want to make sure I'm not missing any little doodads hiding off on the side, and so I'm trying to be diligent. Yeah, like over there, and then. Hold on. 
Making sure there's nothing off the beaten path. Okay. Up, oh, see over there. Got I, I guess we gotta zigzag our way through. Y'all ain't gonna, <laughs> y'all ain't gonna spoil our walk through Madon's little secret area here. Yeah, and then like, what's that in the sky? <laughs> Giant meteor slams down. Oh my god, he's here. Okay, they're high fiving. They're patty whacking. What's you happening? Teach me how to use a sword. You're a legendary stalker. Ugh, so annoying. Jiminy, get rid of him. <gasps> Jiminy! What do you know about this bitch? He's been Jiminy's been awfully quiet this time. What's going on? I'm trying to piece together things, you know. Come on, when's the shoe gonna drop or the puppet string's gonna fall? Also, would my nose ever not be itchy when I'm streaming? I Yeah, how many third- how many <laughs> cords do we have to eat for this playthrough? Yeah, how many umbilical cords do we need to fucking, you know, eat by the spoonful before we gain eyes? Well, it's okay, I see a red memory over there. What's going on? Yeah, Jiminy, you got some splaining to do. Oh, I see a stargazer doodad right there. Okay, what's going on? I'm gone. No. I'm sorry. I was too late. I, I wish I'd got here sooner. If I had known this would happen. Hmm, a lot of people have regrets so far. I mean, the whole city's gone to shit. I feel warmth! Uh-oh. Human warmth. My memories, or whatever's... Okay, is there anything behind here? Come on, game, throw me a bone! Give me a little treat. Okay. Let's use the Stargazer, then, before we go any further. This usually means I need to pee. Yeah, it's, your pee is getting war It's getting warmer <laughs> before you pee-pee. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yep, yeah, big bitches. Oh, wow. This is quite the fortress, actually. Look at all that. Snake architecture, big scary guys blocking the way. Cool. This is a neat area, honestly. You know, it's a, kind of refreshing, because, like, you know, everything else has been, you know, city blocks, more narrow zones, and then it's like, ooh, big open area, big, big old dust field. Arch, oh, the Abbey. Time unknown. Oh, and they have cannons! Oh! Oh, God! <laughs> okay, hold on. We gotta run. We gotta fucking... Oh, okay, we're getting out of here. I have an idea. Let's leave. Oh, my God. It looks like the fucking bullets from Mario. They're huge. Oh! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh! Oh, my little leg! Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I just want to grab the shit. Hey, watch it! Oh, there we go. Hey, Asia, single shot put. How ge how generous of you, video game? Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Oh God! The gang's all here. I'm out. I'm out. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Bye. Ugly, stupid. Ooh, yay, yay, yay. Okay, let's kill some of these bullet bitches, yeah? Let's make the path a little more clear for myself. Well, hopefully without aggroing the entire fucking armada. Oh my god. New idea. We run through and we get out of here. Hold on. Oh god! Fellas! Oh, okay. what is happening? Hello? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> okay, I should have just ran, ran. 
Once again, boo-boo keys on the ground and me just being like, ooh, shiny, gotta pick it up. Gotta pick that shit up. Got jammed inside the gears. Oof. Got panini pressed by that thing. Typical day as, as a grinder twink. Eh. All right, let's go. Yeah, Liza P have normal enemy spacing, impossible. Well, like in he here particularly, like this is screaming, just run for it. You know, they don't, th fighting this is ridiculous. It's like literally a sea of bullets and, well, I guess they, ah, got, sh get shot, idiot. Um, and a bunch of monsters, let's just run. Let's just get to the next stargazer. <laughs> but not before I grab these little things. So said, uh, <laughs> Shot put, very nice. Woo, excuse you. Bob and weave, bobbing and weaving. Weaving and bobbing. Star fragment, there you go. Oh, acid, okay. Is the, is the enemy coming up weak to acid? Okay, that. Now that seems like is that a redo of the fucking wrestling boss that sure does seem like it okay let's see if we can find a shortcut before that um lemons i guess lemons is there a shortcut or is there another stargazer close by or do i need to run past him i guess lemons go back to the hotel so you can finish up the weapon girl side quest oh shit okay like if i progress past here do i not get shit no shortcut oh boy Either that or Grey Hulk. No shortcut. Right. I must run. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, I guess other lemons. If I get past this guy, can I not return to the hotel? Like, is there is the game going to warn me before I'm past the point of no return before finishing up my side quests? Like, I don't know if I can beat this guy first try. I guess I could try if I die and I'll just go back and complete the hotel shit. The scorpions don't respawn, FYI. Okay, good to know. You can return after this guy. Let's give it a whirl then. Let's give it our best. In this case, okay, he's acid. This guy's weak to acid, so let's put some acid on. Got a few of these, let's use them. y'all <clears throat> lock and load let's see let's give it a try big man upstairs Woo! Oh, he's shocking me. Oh my god, that damage! Ah, god! Or that lack of damage, rather. Oh my, Jesus Christ, hold on. I have a plan. What if we just run? <laughs> I don't think it's gonna open up. I need a high level alchemist badge, oh shit! I'm guessing he has the high level alchemist badge, am I wrong? Here is the wall, yep. Okay, I see. Yeah, big wrestling man upstairs, door guardian. Ow, okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. Really? What is it? Let's leave. Is this the big bitch boss that everyone was warning me about? <laughs> is this the guy? Is this our lad? Yeah, me empathing as he has the badge. Okay, let's go back to the hotel then. Let's 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 wrap up what we can. I yeah, back to the hotel. Oh, I'd actually like to go to the hotel.
Okay. Well, I noticed he had three different points of, you know, three different hitbox zones um, or where the lock on was. He had his torso and both of his legs. I wonder if the shtick is to break his legs, is it literally go up to him with a sledgehammer and try to visceral attack him to death, you know? Hmm. Okay. Hold on. All right. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's talk, ma'am. I heard it from a recent arrival. Alidoro is dead. I know he's a fake, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, big old imposter. I wonder what happened to the real Alidoro, the one who saved me. I shudder thinking about it. I wonder what the real Alidoro was like. I wonder what I was like. Uh, ah, uh, shit! Oh, God! He was murdered! How terrible. The fake Alidoro killed the real one? My gosh. Oh shit, did I just lock myself out of the private area? I should have clobbered him with one of the weapons lying around. Bad. <laughs> He's dead. So the Did I just lock myself out of the secret area? Or in other words, karma. I sure fucking did, didn't I? It's Don't get mad at me! I'm sorry, she needs to know! As the truth often does. I can't? Oh, okay, thank God. Oh, there we go. Hey, hey, we got some tunes. I think you're okay. 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 All right, cool. Because I was like, I'm like, why are you telling me to lie? How, how important is it? You can tell the truth here if you want to. Okay, thank God. Thank God. Okay. Also, can I access the optional area now? Or what? I, you know, let me talk to Mangini. I can hardly options. believe it. But the ergo readings you gathered leave no doubt. No doubt at all, you see? Okay, Vanini, breathe. Despite your best efforts, they can't read your mind yet. I can, Sig. Maybe we should. My apologies. But when you hear this news, you'll be excited. The puppets were being compelled by the Grand Covenant. <gasps> but they were communicating with each other with wavelengths. This is beyond anything I'd imagined. They were not built with this kind of intelligence. I did the best I could to decipher the wavelengths, but there was considerable noise in the signal. Care to give it a listen? Carlo, I hope you can hear me. Ah! The laws of the Grand Covenant bind us. We're his puppets. First law. All puppets must obey the Creator's commands. Law Zero. The Creator's name is... Geppetto. <gasps> Giuseppe. Geppetto. Gasp! Ah, did you hear that? The last part sounded important, but there was too much static. Ah, tell me you heard it, please. We need to find the cause of the frenzy, and this may be our best... Crisscross! Uh, is it? Yeah. What? Or who? I knew Geppetto's been sus this whole fucking frenzy? time. Shit, what do I say? Lie? Oh, I don't know! <laughs> Geppetto. Lo Zero, the creator's name is... I don't know! One can't make these things up. That was the cause of the frenzy. But why would Geppetto of all people... See, this is a nightmare for me, because I, I don't like lying. I am not a lying person. Don't save him. If anything, I over-explain myself so fucking often. Again. I was beginning to despair. Yeah, what a twist for a story. It's been around for like a century. Yeah, like I knew Geppetto was sussy as fuck. I don't know what I just sealed his fate for. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Vengidi's gonna have him fucking killed. Que bello. A brand new design. And there we are. Done. Yeah, yeah, next play. I am doing another playthrough, so. You're dealing with genius, but the device bordered on genius itself. If you ever meet the creator, get me the. No, sorry, I'm sure. I am a little busy trying to save everybody. Yeah. Dear my beloved sister. Oh, oh, this is the note. Okay, I wonder if they updated this. Hold on. You are here. Nope. Okay. Yeah. Someone said that like I, if I talked to Vengini first, then I could have followed it up and got more dialogue here. But what a second playthrough things, guys. Second playthrough. Uh, 
How many new game plus cycles did you do for Armored Core 6, by the way? I believe I'm on my, uh, I mean, I've only been halfway through my second playthrough, but I do intend to do, like, the full four playthroughs, whatever is necessary to see all the stuff, so. Yeah, I haven't done the full, because uh, I know, like, part, uh, playthrough three has even more shit. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> Alright, let's upgrade, let's finish this boss weapon, then. Oh, I need money. I forgot I'm poor. Hold on. I have a bunch of these things in my bag. There we go. You're here. You're here and you're there? What are we? Okay, hold on. There we go. Hey! There we go. And now we got, uh, for the mo Okay, not the full upgrade. Full moon? We need two more? Shit, baby. This is a very- Boss weapons eat up a lot of rare equipment- <laughs> rare, uh, uh, smithing stuff. Okay, I also got some more weapons that I haven't really messed around with all too much, but I'm pretty happy with what I have. So I upgraded this all the way, which is nice. Let's see how different this is from the one I'm currently using. No, it's actually worse. Um, but it's not upgraded all the way, but it's fucking expensive. So yeah, okay, we're sticking with this. Going with all we got, babes. Yeah, you'll have to do two playthroughs anyway, because uh, uh, Eugene gives two uh, uh, records based on the answers. Yeah, okay, yeah. Speaking of which, let's listen to let's listen to the sad song. This one. Here we go. Play me a little tune. Let me grab my apples while I'm at it. Ooh, guitar. Ooh, no. Oh, this is a little yeehaw. Oh my god, howdy. Oh, this is nice. Aww. Somber, but nice. Have I checked the painting recently? Oh, I haven't. Not, not since the hotel attack. Let's check it. So I don't know how many quartz I have. Let's see if I can upgrade anything there. It's our last chance to go full RPG, really, since we're in the end game now. Hell yeah. It's growling. I forgot Geppetto's been kidnapped. <laughs> I was like, where's Papa? Oh, I have one quartz. Okay, cool. I know that's like a weird thing to invest in, but mind you that this boss has like a shock effect and I want to raise my stats up just a little bit. All right. Yeah, this song is nice. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of shock resistance soon. Yay! Ew. Okay, let's go. Let's see, I think we can level up twice here. Let's do strength and then capacity. Or, no, stamina. Yeah, stamina for the swings. There we go. No matter what. Yeah, door, yeah, we're at the door, Guardian. Let's, let's try our luck. Again, I'm trying to prep for it as much as I can. Nice song. Ah, oh, what a lovely tune. So sad though. So sad about that doggy guy dying. All right, I'm going to Red Lobster. I gotta get my shot puts. Also, let's go to the optional area. Yeah.
off track, but like I'm part way through Stormblood for 14, and they hold me the same way Heaven's Ward did. Uh, is this called? Yes, actually. A lot of people would say Stormblood has like pacing problems. I enjoyed it because I, I like I like bigger conflicts, or at least like uh, you know, because Heaven's Ward was a very insular kind of thing, whereas like you know a lot of dramatic things happening, but it was really just like you know. Um, in that area, and uh, Stormblood is more about the bigger overarching conflict, and it's kind of got like two halves to it. Um, and I think the second half of Stormblood's a lot better. Uh, so you know, yeah, it's just it, Stormblood is just really long, and it's just a little too like uh, it's it's got a very broadening um, conflict that's got to resolve, and it's just like kind of it's basically two DLCs in one. A lot of people would say, um, but yeah, I enjoyed Stormblood a lot. But that's just like that's Bosses, just me. When it comes to like more, you know, better pacing and concise, it's it, <laughs> Heaven's Word's definitely better in that department. <sighs> what fairy tale will be adapted as the Dark Souls formula will happen? Uh, will next? Do you think? I think some some folks uh, believed uh, Alice in Wonderland would be pretty. Uh, ideal for like a soul something and I think that would also be kind of cool you know again it takes uh, kind of a similar approach to this where it's like uh you know take the general concepts and soulify it and stuff and Alice in Wonderland but like everything's fucked up in Wonderland you know what I'm saying like Tim Burton on crack looking um and uh, I think that would be a good use of uh you know again if you're reinterpreting um uh or using like fairy tales as the reference point um, but I'm excited to see what this company does next. I hope it doesn't get too formulaic in the sense that we just do, like, fairy tale souls. Like, Liza P is obviously very good, very impressive for her first, like, you know, major game from them. Um, but I would like to see something very different, you know, not just, uh, because they can go in the try and true formula way of doing things. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I think Alice in Wonderland would be appropriate, so. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh god, not the spoils! <laughs> it's it's all right, fellas. It's all right. I, I, we're playing safe. That is. Life feels disjointed, and it feels like two different stories. And I heard the two stories were written by two different people. Yeah, you can kind of feel that in Stormblood for sure. Uh, zero thing for the hundred. I mean, it literally is like two major conflicts. Like you're in two different regions. You know, you're uh, now like me. You've got in the first one, and then um. Uh, oh god, I can't remember the second, but you know what I'm saying. Like, yeah, it's literally split up into two. It's two, it's two DLCs in one for the most part, so it's just really big, really long. Maybe, you know, again, to its detriment. Uh, is there a thing for the hundred? Doma, thank you. Yeah, sorry, it's been a while. Uh, <clears throat> but I enjoyed it, you know? I think by the end of it, it's very cool. You know, not to mention it leads, uh, it, like, gradually leads into Shadowbringers, which is fucking awesome, so... All right, where are we going now? I think, yeah, let's go to the, let's see if the optional area is open. Let's open up this pit. All right, let's go, let's go. Let's see if this area is open. Bada bing, bada boom. Actually, I think I could have teleported to a closer stargazer, but whatever. I'm going with memory. Whatever I can remember. Yeah, there it was. <laughs> There's the one I meant to go to. Whoopsie daisy. Getting leg day in. New? Hello? Dog? Okay, I guess it's not a, I guess, I guess I didn't do what I had to do to open it. What am I missing here, I guess, to open up this thing? On the topic of fairy tale themed things, there was Oh yeah, okay, I apparently can still talk to Vingini, I guess I'll go back. ...back in 2019 and took heavy inspiration from older brother's grim fairy tales. Was my fave set release thus far being a fan of MTG? Ah, oh, Magic the Gathering. I don't know much about Magic the Gathering. I, again, wasn't wasn't something I was particularly allowed to know much of anything about growing up, so I just never did. Um, Isaac, thank you for the hundred. Went home from Not for there's some fun, cool Magic the Gathering things, though. Some, like, again, fairy tale like inspirations. Went home from work early, uh, crying today. I need a hug. Donka, thank you for the hundred. I'm I'm so sorry. I, like, I, I, I can only assume at this point. I'm sorry to hear that, but. 
Thank you for the biddies. I hope you can lift those spirits. And uh, it's tis all right to cry it out sometimes. You just got to feel that shit out. Whatever you're going through, you'll get through it. And thank you for being here. So sorry about that. All right, Vangini, lay it on me. You, you may not be aware. Uh, I am an orphan. Yeah, you're literally Bruce Wayne. Italian Bruce Wayne. The authorities in Krat insisted it was a mugging, but I know what I saw. A mad, raving puppet killed them. A puppet that was driven by a murderous lunatic's awakened ego. I know that because- Was it me? Was I that puppet? No, no, I can't be. <laughs> never forget his insane laugh. I have been fitting puppets with the Grand Covenant to ensure no one else ever has to experience the same tragedy I did. I was this close to giving up. But now that you're here, you can take the Wavelength Decoder. It's proof of your brilliant actions. Damn! See what else you can read with it. You might even discover more secrets within the Puppet King's message. You can play it back as much as you like. Just use the stud. All right, let's get down to business. I always welcome. Hi, I'm going to a Chinese restaurant. Oh, okay, for the to, to celebrate good times, come on. All right, Bumby, do you want me to see you out? I can walk you out, make sure you're all right. Yeah, can we now finally understand the puppet, right? I think so. We can put our puppet decoder on, you know? All right, Bummy, just let me, just, just knock on my door when you're, when you're uh, ready to head out, all right? All right, play the Puppet King's Hello. message. I hope you can hear me. I'm Romeo. We grew up together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? We're best friends. Whoa. I'm doing what I can to fend off both the petrification disease and the alchemists. My puppets and I are taking a stand against death itself. Puppets, rise up. That's why I tried sending you messengers. But you got rid of them all. You're still an unstoppable fellow. I remember you. No reason for us to fight, I suppose. I'm Romeo. We grew up together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? We're best friends. I'm Romeo. I think Romeo's Carl's best friend. I feel warmth. All right, is that it? Gotcha. Are we the bad guys? <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Hello, Mysterious. How you doing? Welcome on back. Yeah, we killed our bestie? I think so. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, gosh, I'm gonna have to go back and, like, read through all the lore notes. I can piece some of this shit together. I get some of it's pretty obvious and so I'm just like, hmm, hmm, yes, interesting. Yes, 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 Romeo, Romeo, oh, Romeo. Yeah, toxic yaoi. We literally killed our fucking, fr what's going on? What, what kind of secrets are we holding these pantaloons? I mean, we did have a Might check the cryptic vessel uh, for optional area. Jesus. Cryptic vessel, do I, where's that? But EA wanted to be a little bitch. Sorry, Lamau. We did have a spooky Alice in Wonderland with American McGee series, uh, and we could have gotten more, but EA wanted to be a little bitch! Yeah, no, it's true, though. What was it called again? Um, a, like, Alice, uh, oh, I can't remember what originally, it was cancelled, though, because their EA was like, it's not gonna make enough money, um, despite it, like, being a, a, a massive cult call. Asylum, that's right, I couldn't remember, it was like, yeah, Alice Asylum was, uh, originally planned from the people who made, um, you know, Alice Madness Returns and all that. And uh, uh, EA was like, mm, no, don't feel like it. Now, how do we know this isn't going to make a bajillion quadrillion dollars? So sorry about that. No. And so it died. Aw, Kipo sleeping. Sorry. Anya just sent me a picture of Kipo sleeping, looking really cute, and then saying help. All right. Um... Yeah, cryptic vessel for optional area. Where do you mean? What do you mean? Check cryptic vessel. Where is the, is that a th is that an item or is it a location? Lead me to it. I'm happy to do the optional area. I see how to get in there. Same thing happened in the Xeno Saga remaster. God, it's like it's literally free money, and it's just like, but it will make a quadrillion dollars. So no. Yeah, I was in the Patreon for a year. The dev diary was mesmerizing. I was fucking heartbroken with EA Pro. Proved to be the shitheads, and we all knew they were. Yeah, again, it was like not not surprised, but still very disappointed to hear. Key items, okay. Let's see, 
Maybe. Okay, I'm guessing it's collectibles. Hold on. Is it key key items? Oh, okay. Here we go. Oh, oh, here it is. Okay. Dear beloved sister, please forgive your brother for leaving without telling you anything. I'm keeping this letter even though I don't know when I'll be able to send it. Also, I'm not, I'm not, <laughs> no funny buns, all right? We're getting down to business with the lore. I'm being chased because I know the biggest secret of Krod. I'll probably be able to see you if the alchemists are gone from this land, but I'll have to watch you from afar until that day. I plan to protect you until at least we can live here in peace. Just like how I saved you from the workshop tower. It wouldn't be wonder wouldn't it be it, it would be wonderful if people learned the truth one day. But some truths are better left unknown. Among the alchemists I saw all too often how cruel humans can become. After seeing all the experiments and nightmares that they are responsible for, I've come I came to believe that there is no God. Oh god <laughs> Instead of revealing myself in the and uh, riskier your life and risking your life, I'll choose to vanish forever still. Please remember me if you've ever, if you ever read this letter. Where's the mm, what you say? <laughs> we come from across the wide ocean. I hope there is only truth in your life and, and leave your name here. I know people here call you Eugenia uh, as they, as, as their way, but the name, uh, but that name will protect you. Please remember your real name. Your real name is the end of the passcode decipher is damaged, so it is unrecognizable. Your true name is what in the? This is so Kingdom Hearts coded. Eugene. It was her. I know. Oh my God! It was Dog Bro's sister. Tragic. Let's talk. You're here. Yeah, I can't let her. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like if I knew that, she would give me like the record for it, right? Trauma dump. Yeah, Reddit atheist confirmed he's got a fedora. I love that. I have come to the conclusion after seeing all of these unimaginable horrors that God is indeed dead. What's up with that? <laughs> all right, does that mean I can go do the thing now? Hold on. Hotel Crot. It still says I have. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. Talk to you. At the house of Vanini. Ah. Master Vanini's collection. I did already hit the hanging puppet, you yeah. You have been busy. The House of Vanini deals only in masterpieces and works of special genius, sir. At the House of <laughs> At the House of Vanini. Vanini. Uh, let's see here. All right. Cool. Yeah, talk to the robot butler. What if her real name is Mulan? House of Vanini, even... Mm. Okay, that's it. All right, let's go. I guess, is the thing open? I don't know. Let's see, what's going on here? Yeah, you did the thing. I need the rusty cryptic vessel for optional area. Okay, where is that? <laughs> where is the rusty cryptic vessel? Also, I guess there's a door here I never unlocked. Hmm. Should be open. Nope, still closed from the looks of it. Unless, yeah, yeah, yep, still closed. Yeah. Oh, I get it from the shop. Oh, okay. I gotta talk to. I gotta talk to him then. Okay, okay. I'm right, gonna see if there's anything down there I can grab. Okay, back to we go. All right, we're gonna get down to the bottom of this, guys. I really just want to beef up as much as I can before we take on the fucking door guardian, because apparently he's gonna kick everybody's ass. Then, uh, hold on. Let's look it up. All right, yeah, yeah, him. That's what I thought. Okay, just making sure. Making sure. Thought it was him. No matter what serving welcome to Hmm Hold on.
Did I... My, not, not the right place? Not the right... Did I get the vessel back at the church in the basement? Uh, hard to say. I don't know. Hmm. The poor, yeah, the door guy is a mini boss. It's the next one I should be worried about? Uh-oh, well, people are making it seem like the door guardian was the problem. Okay, well, let's give it a whirl then, shall we? Here, I'm gonna buy some shit. At the house. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the deal is. Hold on. Or is it like you? Do you have it? Okay, yeah, hold on. Oh, he's got like a cool ass fucking... Advance plus four. Hmm. Ooh, this looks good. Yeah, I want this. Hold on. Okay, well then I'll hold off on the secret air. Let me get see if I can get past the door guy then. All right, let's do it. Up, oh, nope. Okay, I gotta wear that. Hold on. There we go. Hey, bada bang. All right. Let's go get door motherfucker at the very least then. All right, let's uh, let's literally open up this fucking pit. All right. The door guy is simple enough that an ultimate boss is pierced by- Oh, okay. See, because I only tried, you know, the one time and got slammed that I'm like, okay, well, let's just try something else. Then let's go somewhere. Let's come back. Because people are- Because, you know, he's hard. He's, 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 he's chunky as fuck, so I assumed it was him. But we didn't give it an honest shot, so let's try again. Oh, hey, there's a little thing he had in grab. Yeah, we need a keyblade in this bitch. <laughs> Every single time. My bingus. All right, come on. Yeah, yeah, fire it off. I really should destroy these things. It's so hard being so cute in this deadly world. Excuse you. All right, yeah, let's just bolt. We're bolting, we're bolting. We're running, we're running. You're stupid, you're ugly! Up! Ah! Ah! Alright, hold on. Okay, I, I hear Anya moving around. I don't want to, like, enter the boss and then have Anya be like, okay, I'm leaving. So, um, give me, like, two seconds. I guess while I'm safe right here, uh, I'll, let, I'll let the boss music play. I'm going to take a quick break. I got to go to the bathroom and get some water. Uh, we're gearing up. I want to beat this tonight. I don't care how long it takes. We're here for the evening, fellas. So, strap the fuck in, okay? Uh, the, the twink carnage continues. BRB.
Don't do anything gay! Too late. Welcome back, everybody. How are we doing? How are we hanging? Stop that spitting! Thank you. <laughs> Not gonna... Now, welcome back. <laughs> Got some water. Uh, no, no snacks, because I ate plenty before a stream, and uh, I just wanted to, had, had to give Anya a goodbye kiss before we got into the fight here. Uh, Anya's going out to, to dinner, because uh, one of her, her buddies is uh, moving out of town, and they're doing, like, a big old hoorah tonight. What was that sound bite? Don't <laughs> what? <laughs> Don't do anything gay! No, it's too gay in here! Uh, for steak? I've seen you. Naked. Don't do anything straight. Oh, no problem, baby. No problem. The hell is that link? Screen light. Hold on. Oh, it looks like a, it looks like the link broke. Scatter. It's fun. Scatter. Get out of here. Um. Yeah. Where in the Discord should I put the link for the optional area? I think in single player chit chat. That's probably your best bet, Aurora. Uh. Yeah. Do sing I guess single player chit chat. That'll help. Oh, the link is valid. Oh, okay, hold on, let me see. The, 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 the tail end of it? Oh, okay, I get, sorry, I just looked like the tail end of it broke, but I guess it's fine. Ugh, every, every fucking game wants to disable my ad block. Every fucking site, my game, every site wants to get rid of my fucking ad block. Hmm. Okay, the swamp bridge. Let's see. Defeat the fire spewing puppet on the side of the collapsed street. Oh, okay, okay. All right, I might go back and let me see how far I can get here. And then when I feel like I gotta, I'm like, I, I'm, I feel like I've hit a wall and I should go back and level up. I will do it then. All right, let's go, fellas. Let's get in there. Let's get his ass. All right, gamer face on. I gotta focus. I gotta focus. Let's do it. Hey, big boy. I lore walked my way in here. Aren't you gonna reward me? <laughs> hey, gotcha. Ooh! Ow. Okay, what's the what's the catch here? He's really beefy. I'm trying to like what's the I'm trying to get a visceral on him. I don't know if that's gonna work. Oh, okay. No, I blocked that. Fuck you, game. Oh shit! Oh god! Oh, who's coming in? KT! Hold on, we're fighting this big bitch. We're getting the shit kicked out of me. Oh God! Oh God! I f that literally made that that sound. Good Lord! KT, welcome on in. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, gamers. Time to thank for the twenty-seven dumpy invasion. Dumpies, fight back! Fight back, guys! KT's dumping all. Yeah, yeah. You dumpy on me, I dumpy back. Guess what's back, bitch? Guess who got their emote back? I think. I don't know. We're just we're seeing if Twitch is gonna remove it again. <laughs> Two arms, my man. Does KT think of the 42? Y'all, please follow Forever KT on my behalf. Spoilers ahead. Spoilers. We're nearing the end of Lies of P, guys. We're going to try to get our way to the end tonight if we can. Um, as you can see, uh, big, big spooky suckage in the sky. I think we're getting close to the bad guy. Um, so thank you so much. And please, guys, follow Forever KT if you haven't already. Thank you, thank you. All right, Lemons, what's the, what's the catch here? Obviously, like, you know, his, his health is... Uh, He's got a big health bar, and he's like, he's diving down every now and then. Is there a way to do a, like, a super fuck you attack on him, or did I just wail on him when he's down bad, you know? Visceral? Can I get behind him? That, yeah, that little leg? I was, yeah, I was going after the leg. Do a visceral? Where is it, though? Because, like, when he's down on his knee, I don't see, I don't see a red radius for me to jump into to do it. Hit it until he falls. Okay. All right. Noted. Let's go again. God, this is quite the trek, though. I wish there was a shortcut here. Maybe we should try killing the scorpion so this is like an easier run. 
Bob and weave, bob and weave. Just gotta hit him. Okay, yeah, well, I guess I was pacing too much. I was lollygagging, I was gallivanting. Ugh. Evo, thank you for the 55. Welcome back. Saying congrats on getting the buttery, the butter dumpy back, Tyler. Also 56 months. Can't stay for long, though, because I have to re review for finals. Have fun. Best of luck on the finals, and thank you so much. Welcome back with the 56. Appreciate the pop. -up. And yeah, the dumpy's back for now. Um, it got banned like two years ago, and Twitch changed their TOS to allow twerking, and I think that counts, so... Um, I put it back in under a different prefix, and uh, I think uh, hopefully that works. We'll see. We'll see how long we can get away with dumpy uh, freedom. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's try it again. Another one. Okay, he's a toughie. All right, what's going after his little leg? Oh fuck me! I'm dead. Move! What are you doing? Oh my god. Okay, fuck you, bro. Okay, I blocked that! Come on, game! Oh, fuck you! Okay, alright. You know what? We need shock resistance. I don't like being slow. Good lord, what the... I don't like it when I'm clearly blocking and it doesn't register the block at all. You know, I don't care. I, like, I get it. You don't have to give me a perfect block, but give me a block. Like, good lord, I'm hitting the button, please. Ah, oh, this trek is gonna suck. You know what this feels like? This feels like fighting Gwen in Dark Souls 1. God damn. It's like, you know, it's not the fight that draws you out. It's it's the, it's just the walk back. Yeah, I saw the the shock is destroying my stamina. I know, I know. That's why I said, hey, I should probably focus on the shock stat. <laughs> stat. I didn't realize it was, like, building up that fast. Shit's ridiculous. Oh, fuck off. Come on. Anyone would flatten bread? You guys like your, you know... You guys like your super butter naan? Okay, hold on. Yeah, back it up, back it up so I can switch this out. Actually, hold on. Hold up. God, I wish I had a specter for this one. There's literally a fucking fog gate. Why isn't there a specter? Uh, all right, let's see. Where is the dock resistance? There we go. God, I'm running out of these. That's not good. Okay. Let's do... We are fighting a thing, the thing. Fucking sumo wrestler thing. Or WWE thing. Fuck off, bro. <laughs> Heal! What? Move! <laughs> I like, I don't. Oh God, am I? Oh, for God's sake. There we go. Hey! Oh my God, move! That's annoying. I don't like that. I don't. Oh my god. I was in the spot. Bro. Okay, I'm, t I'm tilted. I'm tilting. Fuck off. Why is the shock thing building up so. I mean, like, I put the status thing on. Oh, fuck off, game. Okay. It's Joe over. That was annoying. <sighs> this dude is the worst. Shock is not electric shock. They are two to say what? Send
since when? I guess that I guess since now. What? Okay, shock of the like what? I'm sorry. Is there a different kind of shock I've never heard of before? Oh my, yeah, electric shock versus sh no game. That's silly. No, no, bad video game. That's redundant. That's redundant. That is a stoop. No, that is dumb. I'm sorry. Okay, no, this is this is this game has been very fun, but it's got some stinky poopy bosses in this case. This is redundantly dumb. There should only- if there's gonna be something called shock, there should only be the one shock. Why are there two shocks? Again, is there a different type of shock that I've never been aware of in real life before? When someone gets shocked, do I assume it's made out of wood or some dumb shit? <laughs> it's a choice. That is a choice. It is- it, redundant status effect. No video- no. Bad. <laughs> bad! <laughs> Probably a translation. Maybe, because it seems to, again, it's a, it's a slow thing. It's a slow effect. Yeah, psychological shock versus electric shock. <laughs> Our finger shock was kind of a dirt. That shit was electricity, though. That thing was so electric charged. Emotional shock. Oh, whatever. I was like, why is, yeah, I was like, why am I still getting affected by this, even though I have the fucking re the repellent on? My bad. Shock, like, I guess it is days, yeah. It, I think that is a translation oopsie, but, like, having them both, one's electric shock and the other one is shock is just, is re Either it's a translation issue or it is a redundant status effect. I will, I will say that much. Okay, welcome to my critique of Lies of P on the fly. Um, okay, yeah, in this case I have several, I have, I have seven of these. Okay, let's make it count then. That should make things a little easier. I also don't like that I was in the zone to do the visceral and it didn't land. That's, that pissed me off. I'm upset. Give me my money back. doesn't work. Oh, fuck off, game. There we go. There we go. Open up this pit. Let's get the juice going. Whoa. Okay, yeah, that helps. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Here, I meant to do this. Let's go for that little leg. Come here. Oh my god, move! There we go. Yeah, okay, the shock thing makes a big difference, knowing what status effects was actually fucking me up. Good to know! Ha! Huh, there we go. Hey, I just got one question, dummy. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Oh my god. Stop fucking lying. This box took gatekeeping literally. Yeah, for fucking real. Seriously, like, not knowing that they're doing the status effects is... Very apparent now, made a big difference. All right, cool. I passed where I where I got to. Oh shit, oh shit. Aurora, honestly, if, if don't worry, if you want to tab out because spoiler reasons, I totally understand. Just let me know so I can give you a standing ovation for being so sweet today. Okay, to reward myself because it is the evening, guys. We're having a beer, cracking open a cold one with the boys, cheers. I normally don't be sipping on stream, but it's the evening. We're keeping these good vibes going, okay? <laughs> I 
I got a Mike's. Oh, yeah. What are we sipping tonight? Got, please don't make fun of me for my beer choice. It's cheap and I it, it's palatable. I, I, I drink Miller Light. It is my beer right now of choice. I've also had a beer kick. Like, I've, I'm always a wine mom back in the day. Um, but I, I've been loving having a nice cold, you know, draft with, with dinner. Um, and, uh, yeah, Miller Lite's kind of my choice because it's always on sale. <laughs> beer dad mode yeah i don't know what happened i like ever like oh i'll tell you what happened um this was like a while ago i like back in the day i didn't like beer when i first tried it you know when i was like you know became of drinking age um so i got accustomed to wine and then uh, i uh didn't drink beer for like years and then like and i would have like sake uh, sake i would have you know sake with uh with like uh with Korean barbecue or hot pot, because it's like, you know, you got you got to have a little sip on the side. Love me some sake. Uh, and uh, and soju and stuff, you know, that was like, I liked rice-based alcohols because it didn't make me feel sicky afterwards. It was very light, you know, and get you drunk. Um, <laughs> if you want a little kick with your food, right? And then we went to a Korean barbecue place like a year ago, and they didn't have, um, they didn't have soju or sake. All they had was beer. And I'm like, well, I guess I'll get a beer. It's been a long time. And you know what? It really hit well with my food. I was like, mmm. Actually, it was more like, mmm, that's pretty damn good. So, like, after that, I was like, you know what, do I like beer? I guess now that I'm, like, more accustomed to, like, alcohol and how it tastes, because, you know, I'm not, like, 20, like, I'm not 20 anymore. I'm, like, close, closing to my 30s, right? Drinking alone on Thursday. I'm not alone. I got my gamers. Pissing all by yourself, handsome? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, after that one time at Korean barbecue, I'm like, I think I like beer again. Or I, I, I'm actually enjoying it for for realsies now. So yeah, it's all right, you know? It'll say, I, like, I don't particularly drink to get like hammered. I think that's a lot, like, I'm definitely, definitely not. Um, but I like having a little, you know, sip on the side with my food in this case. And I had dinner earlier, so. Uh, depending on my uh, alcoholic taste at the time, um, after the kid is born, yes. <laughs> Obviously, I'm going completely cold turkey, you know, if and when I decide to uh, to incubate a child for nine months. You know what I'm saying? Zero, thank you for the hundred. Uh, now, it'll we'll definitely, you know, go, rotate on, on who was dad, I guess, in that moment. I'm kind of beer snobby, lol, and personally not a fan of light beer. I can understand that. They do kind of taste like pee. Yeah, no, it's definitely like a... It's just easy, you know what I'm saying? It's simple. I think that's why I like it. I also like um, 808s. Those are really good. My, um, my, uh, I guess my cousin-in-law, <laughs> he's gotten me on those. All right, gotta head out. Gotta pack for a trip and don't want to spoil myself. Good luck. Aurora, thank you so much. Have a good evening, a great evening, and uh, thank you so much. Congrats on being the sub-gifter, and I hope you have a great time on your trip. Thank you so much. Wine is too powerful for me. It's too tasty. I think it's like a 4% cider or something and then I'll end up hung over. Yeah, I can only have like two beers or so. And at that point I'm like, all right, we're gonna, we're gonna sotten it off here. But yeah, wine is heavy, you know, at least like, I don't particularly like white wine all that much. I like red wine, the taste is great, but it, it is like much higher percentage normally, um, especially if it's a dry red. And uh, yeah, that shit can get you drunk. So yeah, I think beer is nice in the sense that it is very light. You know, it's not, it's not very, you know, heavy on alcohol, that kind of thing. Um, anyway, all right, this has been my beer talk. I'm a beer dad now. Sorry, guys. Hope you know that. <laughs> yeah, I've been, uh, uh, I like being allergic to alcohol because I get buzz after one beer. <laughs> Some people are like it. Yeah, no, it takes a lot to get me hammered, hammered. So I'm like, yeah, beer too is nice. I am a beer dad. Yeah, I don't know. I've been going through like this phase. So bear with me, guys. All right, let's open up this fucking door. Use the badge that I think I just got. Yeah. The alchemists are buff as fuck. They're working out out here. Clearly got a lot of protein running around. I'm having my king of the hill air. Yeah, exactly it. That's exactly it. All right, there we go. Stargazer activated. Beautiful. I think I'm actually going to spend all these. Hold on. We're going to Red Lobster again. Literally always going back to Red Lobster to get the shot puts. So worth it. Here. Yes, five. Number five, Red Lobster. 
I like cold sake. Uh, they have warm sake where it's heated in uh, hot water while um, while in the serving. Oh, I prefer warm sake. I think it I think it tastes, but I love sake. The problem is that it's very, uh, at least like compared to like wine and stuff. Um, sake's normally on like 14% or higher, which is considered like very, very strong wine. Um, so you can get drunk off it very fast. I normally get like a very small liter, you know, like the little 12 ounce little pour bottles and stuff. Um, but yeah, warm sake is great. If you guys have never had it, I highly recommend it for people who really hate the alcohol burn. Um, sake is great because it's very smooth, uh, especially like, you know, the more expensive it is, the smoother it is. I've had very expensive sake before that I bought for my birthday and I'm like, damn, this shit tastes like cream Buns almost. It's crazy. Too, you know? Enjoy the black market. Just between glitch. you and me, Buns. I think these alchemists are juicy. They are a little juicy. Absolutely. <laughs> the real question is for everybody else. Uh, where's the juice? Give my son the juice! Where's our juice? That's the real question. I got 15 of these things. Fuck yeah. Yogurt soju is so... Oh, absolutely. Yeah, anyone who's ever had rice-based alcohol, sake, soju, um, and uh, I guess those are like the two big ones, you know, and among other things. Um, soju is dangerous because of its super high percentage, and if it's flavored, you do not realize how drunk you're getting until it's too late. So, you know, be, be mind... Like, if you go out with friends and someone gets a bottle of soju, do not let them drink that bottle by themselves. They will be fucked up. One bottle of soju for one person is gonna fuck you up. You need to share that amongst at least three other people. Um, cause you should take it like shots, you know? And that it'll work. <laughs> That's the problem people, that's the mistake people make with it, is that they think it's just like a sippable bottle or something, or it's just a very strong, you know, like wine. And it's like, no, if, if, if you get a flavored soju, you're not going to really, you're not going to taste all the alcohol in it. You get like a, you know, like a good friend's like basic, you know, a flavorless, you'll be able to taste it. But most people have a flavored one and it will. Also, Dr. Seuss, thank you for the hundred thing. I got some Powerade and salt and vinegar chips because apparently I like to hydrate while I <laughs> Purposely dehydrate. That's the best flavor combo. Take take a sip of hydration with a few bites of dehydration. Mm, it's a great combo, actually. <laughs> yeah, drinking soju is a social thing. There are rules and shit. Yeah, well, Ani always, um, we do this fun, th she taught me this like little drinking trick. Uh, I recommend it for people who ever have soju in a, a group setting. Um, is that when you unscrew the bottle and it's got that little, you know, metal string, uh, you know, attach, uh, you know, like the, the thing you can basically peel off. You keep that attached to the lid and you twist it and you make it to where people flick it and you take turns flicking it. And whoever flicks off the little extra metal band from the cap um, has to take the first shot. That's that's normally the drinking game that we play. It's a lot of fun because you're like, oh, who's got the most powerful flick to like knock this little, you know, string of metal off the cap. Um, it's very cute. I recommend everyone do it. But yeah, please do not drink soju alone, and uh, especially by yourself in the sense because that it'll fuck you up, you know. Buns, when is the next gaming news? The news about the Last of Us multiplayer is blowing up my Twitter feed. Um, the next gaming news is going to be this weekend, uh, and uh, we'll talk about that for sure. We kind of knew that was coming, actually. If you tune in regularly to gaming news, there were reports that. The Last of Us multiplayer factions was on thin ice and it was basically in a pending stage of whether or not it should be canceled. We got reports of that a few months ago. Um, so now that we're seeing it is being canceled, they did assess that it is not worth continuing. And I think that's for the better. I was hoping they would cancel it because like, I think considering, you know, the reception of the Last of Us 2 remaster, and everyone kind of getting sick of Naughty Dog milking the fuck out of The Last of Us needlessly, a multiplayer live service game was definitely going to piss people off if it was like officially shown off and stuff. And they were struggling with making it fun, um, apparently from reports, and it wasn't passing the vibe check behind closed doors. So I'm glad that they canceled it, and I think that was for the better, for sure. <clears throat> what do you mean? I'll drink soju alone right now. You ain't alone, Luz. <laughs> you with your gamer girls. You with your pals. Yeah. Yeah, don't fucking take a big, take a fucking sip, babe. I dare you. Anyway, but yes, we'll be covering it in gaming news. All right, okay, let's get through the cannonball torture chamber, I guess. Let's walk. Let's get out of here. Oh, good lord, okay. Ooh, bolt. Blasting past my head. Big guy on the stairs, hold on. 
Apparently, yeah, let's get the nice angle so we don't get swooshed. There we go. And, and he's gonna blow up normally. No? Okay, I can't tell. I can't tell these goopy guys blow up half the time. I guess that they're not wet enough. True, and I will. All right, Kurt, fucking bottoms up. Bottoms up, bro. Getting crunk on a Thursday. Let's go. I'm just hoping we get something new from Naughty Dog. I think from the reception of the Last of Us 2 Raymaster, I think we are. Um, especially now that Factions has been canceled. I mean, that's a lot of work, though, to can cancel. Um, like, you know, God knows that they had made a good, decent enough progress on it, but, uh, yeah, I think it, canceling it is obviously a setback and a bunch of time wasted, but, um, I, I like, I'm, I'm, a, I, I like that they're doubling down and like, no, we're a single player game studio. I think that's for the better. Now this is a big boy. Okay, you know what? Hold on. No, come here. If you're gonna fight me, let's fight on my terms. Okay, it's not fair that you get, you know, father slingshot up there throwing the rockets at my head. Bitch. Okay, come here. No, what are you walking back to position? All right, yeah, back to one, I guess. Ah! Oh, God. Oh god, not this camera, hold on. Bro! Oh god! <laughs> okay. I have an idea, let's fucking run. I have an idea. Really? What is it? Let's leave! I saw that coming. I'm like, I don't I don't like this angle, I don't like this slope, I don't like the ballistics shooting at my head. None of this was in our favor. Doom from the get-go, take two. Twink gone. Twink obliterated on site. In masses. Scoot, scooch. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna get John Ballistics up there. Come on. Yeah, ugly. Oh, fuck off! Oh my god! Oh, use the badge. Hi! <laughs> I hope you don't mind. Eye frames. Go fuck yourself. Oh, okay, sick. It's not a door, it's a gateway thing. It's, 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 we, we pulled the lever. Now let's get the fuck out of here before these guys pummel me into the ground. Excuse me. All right, running back, running back. I'm sorry, let's go, let's fucking go. Oh, I see, okay, there's a ladder shortcut up there. Very nice. I don't know why I kept thinking those pressure plates thing it was like, oh, you have to stand on it long enough. I'm like, no, just show the badge, idiot. Let's go. All right. Bro, what the? Oh, he caked me up. Ew. Okay, yeah, you're paying for the dry cleaning on this. Oh my God, he threw up on me. It's the sewer level two. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, not the decay shit. All right, yeah, goop it up somewhere else. I don't want to see it. Here we go, moving on, moving on. All right, repair tool, very cool. This somehow feels worse than the swamp level. Yeah, when you have a rocket being shot at you, it's always kind of automatically harder. Ah! Not your friend. Fuck off, but oh my god. These things really launch you sometimes. I am, ab I am about this weapon. This thing has been very good. Yeah, cannons and goopy poopy. God, just peeing my cereal at that point. Okay, this reeks of boulders, flaming boulders. Let's get this guy though. I'm, I'm feeling boulders in the air. You, death, death to all of them. Uh. 
die. No gun for you. You don't have a permit. Ugly. Are you feeling <laughs> boulders? Are you feeling something? Am I feeling boulders gaty in this house tonight? Also, little knack, thank you for the 67. Two things. Uh I've been, I've enjoyed I enjoyed beer or craft beer and mojitos and margaritas. Also, I've been thinking about moving out and living on my own in overseas countries far from Thailand. Uh, but don't get me wrong, Thailand is being LGBTQ friendly and it does have the convenient things uh, around uh, Bangkok. And also, I've never uh, lived or traveled in the U.S. Oh shit! Well, I can always recommend for the sake of just like you know experiencing the world. Um, obviously there's dangers that come with, you know, leaving, leaving your home country and all that, but it builds character. You will have very eye-opening experience really no matter what. Um, so I always recommend it for the sake of just like broadening your horizons. Little Knack, thank you for the 67. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, obviously do your research, go to a place you feel safe at. Um, but, uh, really I highly recommend anybody if you, you know, however you can or will or, you know, pacing yourself, if you ever get the opportunity to travel, or you know, live outside of the country uh, of your home country. Please do. It's it, it is it is a very much you know, uh, I would say good for the soul and uh, helps you know kind of expand your worldview a little bit. <clears throat> and also you know always it always helps if you have a friend who like yeah uh, travel with someone at least with experience for sure. Like Anya and I, Anya has way more travel experience than I do, but we travel very well together. And uh, it's been great, you know, going to so many locations with Anya and uh, has definitely been, you know, a highlight uh, of uh, being with her and stuff is, you know, just just the general worldliness of it, right? Also, uh, Continent Pop, welcome on in. All right, investigate. Wake up, evolve, ascend. Greet the god who will soon resur... <sighs> interrupted me. Greet the god who will soon resurrect from the top of the abbey. Are we gamers rise up? I'm like, are we summoning God in this souls like? Say it ain't so. Ascension. Hey, okay. Let's see if I can make my way through here without getting squished. What's past this door? Please tell me it's a stargazer. I'm gonna see if I can get big boy here. No, come here, what are you doing? Excuse me. <laughs> Goo, goopy, ugly too. Mama, please, 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 be nice to me. Oh my god, look at my health. Look at my fucking health. Holy shit. Holy cannoli. All right, we got him. Cleared. Whew. Why do these enemies remind me of something from Bayonetta 3? Oh, you were so right. I think it's the color palette for sure. Like, you know, the crystallization. A monkey looking ass. All right, a little messy, but we got it. Oh, I think there was a shortcut that I could have knocked down. Hold on. Well, see, we got the ladder here. It looks like we got the yeah the door there, the ladder here. One second. Well, it's fine. Okay, I think I think we'll find the next stargazer soon. It's okay. It is all right. It is all right. All right. Okay. Yeah. Fuck me. Let's go this way. Also, sharpen up. Buff out those scratches. Squidward in a chair. 
Whoa, yeah, we're almost there. This music reminds me so much of the score between uh, uh, Avatar Aang and uh, King Ozai. This is gonna be big. It is very epic. Very, you know, you know shit's about to get real when the choir kicks in, right? All right, taking a sip, my bib. Let's go. Hey, I was right, okay. Because I saw like a little, um, uh, what's what I'm looking for? Uh, ladder shortcut over there that I didn't unlock, but it doesn't matter because here's the other stargazer. All right, and I'm also gonna go buy, you guessed it, more shop puts at Red Lobster. You saying flaming boulders reminded me of this scene? Oh my gosh, hold on, let's see. Much, it, it, the, it flame, flames, flames on the side of my face. <laughs> me, yeah. <laughs> me trying to explain in vivid detail how I got flattened and on fire, potentially. Did I get my whale fix? Uh, the submarine is very, very whale adjacent, I would say. All right, hi. The bosses were purchase. Thank you. As many as these as I can. Thirty of these in my bag. Perfect. I know this is like an excessive amount to spend on these, but these items are very good, so very worth it. Me going to Red Lobster ordering all the shrimp. Mm, I had shrimp today. I got one of those little five dollar lunch boxes of shrimp. So good. So tasty. You ever think about, sh like, I, I, you know, for I'm sure everybody's like, duh, but it's like, you know, seafood is just sea bugs, but it tastes so damn good. You know what I'm saying? Bums, what are your top five places you want to travel to? Oh, shit. I feel like I've already traveled to a lot of my top five places. Um, there's some beautiful cities in China I've always actually wanted to go see. I've been seeing a lot of um, picturesque places. Uh, I couldn't name- I couldn't name exactly off the top of my head, but I haven't visited China yet, and I'd like to. Or also Hong Kong. Um, I haven't been to Japan yet. I'm going there for my honeymoon. Big excite. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, like, Iceland was off- uh, was top for a while, and I- Anya took me to Iceland for my- my, um, my birthday, like, two years ago, which was really amazing. Um, let's see. Anya wants to go visit fucking Chernobyl. I don't know- <laughs> I don't know if I wanna- if I wanna do that. I'd like to, you know, not to- that- uh, fucking expose myself to high amounts of radiation or what's left over there. Um, and obviously not an ideal time to visit right now, considering. But yeah, I know there's a lot of uh, places I'd like to visit and stuff, but um, I'm selective with my traveling. You went to the Death Stranding? It was awesome! I Iceland was amazing. That was the, what, the best birthdays ever. We went around the end of summer and... Uh, uh, yeah, playing Death Stranding is crazy, too, because it's like, I know what that air, you know, tastes like, basically, or smells like, you know, I, I know what that, that terrain feels like. Um, and, uh, yeah, I, if, any, if you've never traveled to Iceland, uh, obviously also not an ideal time right now, but considering the fucking, you know, uh, uh, volcano is on the verge of erupting. Um, but I did stand on, like, frozen magma, which was crazy. Um, like, we didn't man- we didn't get to the- the top of where the volcano was erupting. This is before it was, like, going crazy. This was when it was, like, a tourist attraction. Um, but Anya and I did stand on, like, the frozen magma pit that had come down the valley, and we took some rocks with us. <laughs> Don't tell the Icelandic government. Um, but yeah, that shit was amazing. So yeah, I highly- Iceland is a very beautiful country. I highly recommend anyone travel there if they can. Um, and, uh, it's actually, like- I guess compared to, like, other places to fly to, if, especially if you live on the East Coast, it's pretty, like, affordable to fly over there compared to, like, other places, you know? Because it's actually not that far. Um, but yeah, Iceland's a gorgeous country. <laughs> all right, anyway. But yeah, you can thank Anya all for that, because I don't plan this shit. Anya, Anya is, is, is the queen of credit card perks, points, and travel miles. She is one of those people that, like, has been able to pay for everything using points. Um, and, and she's a master at it and stuff, so she takes it very seriously. And, uh, we fucking milk those points for all that they're worth, so I just show up and I'm like, hi. <laughs> Let's see. Also, what the fuck? Okay. Yeah, this is getting a little godlike, a little false idly. Hmm. I don't know if Jesus would approve of any of this. 
Icelandic government! Knock, knock, FBI! Oh, no! They're like, hey, what happened to those lava pebbles that you stole? FBI, open up! Yeah, and when I say, like, lava rocks, I'm talking, like, just bits of pieces of broken magma that, uh, and I'm, t like, they're the size of pebbles, you know? <laughs> but we did take a few <laughs> for, like, uh, souvenirs. Uh, did you hear that Kojima and A24 are making a Death Stranding movie under his direct- I did, I did, which I'm excited about. I like Death Stranding a lot, actually. Um, and as someone who never really liked any of previous, uh, Kojima's work, um, yeah, I think that's, you know. Fuck me, I- and I saw him coming and I did nothing. I saw it, and he's still- Oh, you were gonna throw me into that shit! Oh, sneaky bitch, okay. Yeah, I see. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Now. Now, no suckage, not on my watch. Woo! Oh, he's really throwing it back. Oh, ooh, man, he's got cheeks. Oh! Oh, he's shish kebab my ass! Ow. No, I don't need you either. Fuck off. No! Woo! All right, hold on. Yeah, the, the, turn that off. Turn that off. Excuse you. Excuse you. Huh. That was good timing. That was close. The shish garbob our ass and not in a good way. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you didn't like Metal Gear? No, it's not that, like, I don't... Okay, here's the spiel. I've played a good amount of Metal Gear. I don't dislike it, but I don't love it, if that makes sense. There, I appreciate Metal Gear for what it is, but I'm not a huge stealth person, and the control scheme always bothered me, and I always consumed Metal Gear through, like, YouTube content and, like, cutscene watching. I've I've passively enjoyed a lot of Metal Gear. I'd probably stand outside of the fucking decay. Shoot. Oh, hold on. Whoops-a-daisy. Let's get out of here, shall we? Um... But, uh, I've never- how about this? Like, you know, Kojima has gotten gassed up a lot of- for a lot of his career. He's, you know, he's done- he's made a lot of very impressive, cool games, very thought-provoking games, very gay games. Um, and, you know, Metal Gear is a very iconic series. However, I was never really impressed with- I, I never perceived Kojima as a genius because of Metal Gear. And I was very skeptical of Death Stranding when it was first announced. I thought aesthetically it looked cool, but I thought it was gonna be, you know, a bunch of pretentious hodgepodge crap. And, uh, and to an extent, I feel like it has a little bit of that. <laughs> it's not a perfect game by any means. But, um, ba basically, I went into Death Stranding being very skeptical, being very ready to not like it. And I love Death Stranding. I think it's a great game. I, I really, I think on a, a like, I do think it's a little self-indulgent and over-explained itself a little bit too much and stuff, but I gotta give Kojima credit for really trying to just make something different and has a much more zen feel to it. I think it's also brilliantly creative. Um, you know, it, it looks like a bunch of hodgepodge ideas from the outside looking in, but by the time you get to the ending credits, it does, you know, tie itself up with a nice little string and it makes perfect sense in its own little, you know, lore that it's built up, um, you know, with, like, the extinction stuff. And, uh, yeah, I think Death Stranding's a great game. In fact, I'm playing through it for a third time on, on my Steam Deck right now. So, uh, yeah, that's why I, like, I thought for the longest time Kojima was getting gassed up for no fucking reason because of Metal Gear, because I wasn't that impressed by it. But Death Stranding did impress me, so I'm very excited for, for two. Um, and I appreciate Kojima because he does, you know, he's a guy who cares about art to an extent. You know, he's very, very much an art lover, an art appreciator. Um, and likes incorporating a bunch of his ideas to make something unique. So, <clears throat> anyway, that's what I think about Death Stranding. Um, let's see. Also, we got, like, a little thingamaboop. Let's read it. Let's see here. Uh, where did it go? I wish it would show me, like, what the newest one was. Hold on. Shit. Oh, here, is it this it? Yeah, here it is. Bundle of old letters. Here it is. Uh, as a result of the last summit, we... Oh, hold on. I don't know if I can read all this right now. Oh, God. The alchemists know how to handle so much things. I have no idea. The place known as the Devil Pit had so much value. And when a gold mine of secrets is revealed, you can't put the cat back in the bag. Don't worry about the construction workers. We'll take care of it real clean. Uh-oh. 
once again, the working class gets fucked over. Don't forget, if you look down or try to trick us, not only will the workers who, uh... It's not only the workers who will disappear. Till next time I see you, I'm looking forward to our beneficial exchange in the name of our old house. Jean Vivi. Can't read. Bear with me. Um. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, I think he's a lot more forward-thinking and original than many other directors, uh, although his execution not always good. I think that's a perfect way of summing it up. Yeah, I think there's some goofy-ass shit in Death Stranding, and I don't think it's a universally loved game for, like... You have to have a taste for, like, what it's trying to serve you, basically. Um, but, uh, yeah, I did forward-thinking absolutely in the sense that, you know, like, the whole theme of Death Stranding ended up becoming so relevant in 2020, the year after it came out. Um, which is, which is crazy. So, yeah, I think, I think, um... He's very thoughtful, if not a little indulgent, but, you know, again, there's some, there's some quality, funny, goofy shit in, in Death Stranding, like Prince's Beach. Uh... Let's see... Wait, hold on. Uh, back up, thank you for the 100. I don't know if you heard, but the sub-team on Creative Bidney's Unit 3 has disbanded, I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of sad because I was hoping we could get a Final Fantasy 16 combat system update or moves cooldowns on icon abilities except for the ultimate and allows to equip more than two icons per... What? Creative... A part of Creative U Unit Business 3 disbanded? That doesn't sound right. There's still another DLC coming. I don't know. Check your source on that, Mom. Because, <laughs> like, the 16 DLC just came out and then there's the other big one coming up next year. But yeah, 16's not done getting updates. They're still, they, they still, they even talked about possibly adding in an update to where you can play as Jill. So oh, hang tight. All right, hold on. Mm. Oh yeah, the Jordan P. I think the fucking, what was it, Overdose? That That trailer was bad, in my opinion. Obviously very meme-worthy, but that is not a great first reveal for your new Xbox game or whatever with Jordan Peele. I thought it was a very strange... I know they, like, snuck in some fucking Silent Hills reference. It was still a very weird trailer. I'm excited to see what they're gonna do, though, because that's obviously, like, a duo combo team. My game of 2023, since you mentioned about the Steam Deck, I'm looking for the Legion Go and looks solid and I could be back up. Let's for 2024 at the time. Hell yeah, you never know. Now, this game is pretty damn good. I'm enjoying it. Obviously, we, you know, every now and then there's some silly boss nonsense in here, but for the most part, great game. All right, let's continue, though. All right, enough talking. I mean, they'll continue with the DLC, but no spinoff or sequel. Well, I mean, considering how 16 ended... That's, I feel like that's kind of a given. I don't want a sequel to 16. I don't know how that would even work, you know? <laughs> Unless it's a prequel. All right, hold on. Come here. Okay, oh boy. Oh, oh, okay. Mm. No, disruption, d disruption juice, not about it. Not about it. I don't know. The last time Kojima was teaming, uh, teasing up, the, teasing a team up with a film director, Del Toro. We all know how that ended. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think, considering where they're at right now, funding-wise, I'm not too worried about Overdose becoming a thing, considering it's being made under Kojima Productions, and you know, again, Konami fingers are no longer attached to him, and they don't have to worry about them pulling the plug on anything he wants to make. Rip Silent Hills, by the way. <laughs> what could have been. Although she, okay, hold on. Could, although she could not be completed, may she be with us through her noble sacrifice. Uh-oh. Mama, what you doing, crazy girl? Hmm. I don't know how to pronounce half the people's names in this, but uh, yeah, this is getting, this is getting Eldritch Gotti. I feel like we're, we're going to ascend soon here. Alright, let's go, let's go. Reggie, thank you for the dollar saying, okay, so apparently the main 16 team has been disbanded, but there's still DLCT. Oh, okay. 
Well, that makes more sense, yeah. No, I mean, like, as far as 16 goes, I, I think, like, what, what we're getting with it, I think, is sufficient. I'm okay with them moving on to 17. I think a lot of people are, too. Like, I think we're, we're very much long past the point of direct sequels with Final Fantasy being, like, the norm. Um, you know, there's obviously, like, a period of time where that was very common, and especially, like, you know, in very indulgent... Oh, God! Okay, hold on. Moving to the side. Yeah, third, I think the 13 trilogy was kind of peak, uh, you know, sequels for sequels' sake, not really being necessary, but we're doing it anyway, and I don't think they want to retread that ground anymore. <laughs> Obviously, I think five, uh, 7 Remake is kind of taking up the mantle of sequelism, I guess, amongst the Final Fantasy brands right now. We're gonna become the slug from Bloodborne, we can only hope, if we're so lucky. Are we gonna ascend to sluggage? Do we gain eyes this playthrough? Okay, yeah, we're back here. Back to the Stargazer. Yes, yes. Actually, hold on. In fact, I'm going to rest real fast because I think we're back to the Stargazer. Okay. We're looping. We're looping. And there it is. Okay. All right. Yeah, Kojima slapped the Konami fingers away from the pie. Well, that's why he went independent. So, like, like, I don't know all the details here and stuff, but mind you, like, when Kojima was, you know, kind of cast aside by Konami and, you know, Silent Hills got canceled and he was kind of like, what's going to happen with him? What is he going to do? Um, you know, Sony was obviously very eager to give a helping hand and be like, hey, we'll, we'll produce, like, we'll give you the money for your next game if you make us a, you know, a, a like a PlayStation darling, basically, you know, with Death Stranding. And I guarantee you at some point, Sony offered to have uh, Kojima work for them and be a first party developer. But I think after the Konami crap, Kojima was very eager to be to be an independent developer. Um, and so that's what he did. So, you know, Kojima Productions, uh, even though Death Stranding was, you know, paraded around as like a Sony exclusive for a little bit, and obviously it's not the case anymore, it's on PC. Um, you know, uh, Kojima, I guarantee you, was like denied a, a shit ton of money to become a first party developer so he could maintain, be independent, which is much better in the long run. Um, you know, that way now he can, you know, uh, he can still take contract work and do, like, uh, first-party games for people, or, you know, like, again, Death Stranding is technically a Sony-owned product. Um, but now he can work, you know, with, with Xbox and Overdose and stuff, so, like, you know, this is, uh, him going independent and taking the time and, you know, basically, den I'm sure denying a shit ton of money, uh, to, to go first-party with Sony, I'm sure he's very happy about, you know, again, look at Kojima Productions, uh, the location of it, it's fucking awesome. Like, you know, that big old white room that he takes all the pictures of the celebrity is and, you know, and the their their cool branding fella. It's like, it's good. I'm happy for him. He's, I think the man has earned his independence and now he can make weird ass games on somebody else's dime. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cause you know, Xbox and PlayStation are footing the bill. You know, Xbox is footing the bill for Overdose and Sony foot the bill for, for Death Stranding, but Kojima gets to basically make whatever the fuck he wants with it, you know? Because it's like, hey, it's the Kojima game, right? From my understanding, it was mostly Konami that had the issue with Kojima and throw- Yeah, that's exactly what it was. Again, Konami was going in the course of, like, you know, cheaper games for more money, and Kojima wanted, you know, big budgets for weird big games, and they didn't like that, and, you know, it's, it's a whole mess. But, like, after that situation, he didn't want a corporate overlord telling him what he couldn't do anymore, and that's why he's gone independent. And, uh, despite, yeah, the perception of Kojima Productions being a Sony darling first-party developer, it is not. It's an independent studio. That's why he can make an Xbox game now. Anyone's curious. All right, uh, the, uh, the description cloud. <laughs> Goopy poopy. All right, let's get out of here. Hey, you, you were shooting at me earlier. Fuck you, buddy. I got a permit for that. Okay, where to now? This way. All right, I'm gonna be careful here. We got corners. We got corners and we got, yep. We got bitches on the ceiling. Come here, you. I knew that was coming. I saw that. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, I'll let you clear that out first, I guess. Ugh, God. 
Also, is the game too loud or too quiet? It should be it should be very loud chorus right now. Yeah, Metal Gear Survive was a metal. It's because that was Konami trying to continue Metal Gear without Kojima. You can't do Metal Gear without Kojima because Metal Gear needs a little fuck. It needs some weird gay shit in it. I'm sorry. That's just that's just the Metal Gear twist. Like you can put Snake. It can put you know all the fucking players in there. Uh, all the faces that you love, you know, Ride Nauticon, all whatever, but, like, unless it's a little, if, unless the people are talking for, you know, eight minutes straight, no commas in their sentences, and it's, there's not weird close-ups on their ass, it's not a Kojima game, it's just, that's just how it is, okay? <laughs> that's the law. <laughs> and everyone, and obviously Metal Gear Survive was, you know, obviously trash on several other levels, but, like, um, you just, you just can't, you just can't make Metal Gear without them. It's literally the brainchild of them, you know? The little kisses the men give each other in the series is cute. It is! No, Met Metal Gear is, 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 uh, is gay culture, for sure. Uh, <laughs> all right, let's read this. She is probably the first puppet with Ergo found by the Order. Oh. Uh. Camille? Camille? Whatever her name is. Uh. Before that, Ergo was seen as just a travel expense for a holy journey of the Order. It was God's gift, but they didn't know what it was true. What? What it was. What? Didn't know that it was truth itself. God, man, these sentences are e either I'm super dyslexic or these are a little weirdly written. However, God gave us fools, uh, gave us fools the revelation for our enlightenment. It was God's miracle that uh, Camille was made into a made puppet. Despite being in the early phase when the design was rudimentary, she was caught and saved. She caught and saved a baby who fell from a crib. Oh, it must have been one of those old-fashioned, like, window child seats, you know, like, like, living in an apartment. Let me just put the baby inside the, the window holder so they can get some fresh air. Um, such function was nowhere to be found in the design. Her appearance and identity and living years were similar, so it was probably easy for her to manifest an ego. After hurtling, uh, uh collecting... All right, to launch an investigation, the order found out that she was under that she understands language and got a message. Send me back to my child. Whoa. My interrogating and, and taking her apart, the order had opened the door to a new possibility. Later, means of control such as the Grand Covenant emerged, but it was a small problem compared to this discovery. Ergo is not a simple power stone. It embraces life. Through Ergo, you can open the door to eternal life. Wake up, evolve, ascend. With the discovery, humankind will achieve immortality. Damn, that's crazy. To freedom! Wow. <laughs> okay, I see. It's literally just like souls. Yeah, she's the first independent robot, I figured as much, yeah. Like, oh shit, they can they can think. They have a conscience, they have an ego. Ludness, thank you for the 70 months of the prime! They ripped to the month of 69, you'll be solely missed Ripperoni and D, but hey, 70 ain't nothing to sneeze at. <laughs> Let's take it to the big 70 with the prime and keeping it going. Also, look at all these books. These guys be reading. All right. <sighs> Wake up, evolve, ascend is being uh, said quite a lot. That's concerning, yeah. A lot, a lot of weird ascension possibly going around here. Giving us eyes, giving everybody a little bit of eyes on the side. Oh, fuck off. Okay, hold on. No, 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 no. Let's fight down here, shall we? No, you don't want to hang out? Bitch! <laughs> Alright, can I attack you on the slope? There we go. Very nice. This, see, this one's cheeked up. This is a very cheeked up monster. Like, look, well, you can't see it now, but when his tail is up in the air, man, those things are flapping. <laughs> What's this? P is evolving? My pee pee? My lies? Hmm. 
getting big Matrix vibes from these themes. It's me, the Matrix series lover. I too am a Matrix series lover. <laughs> Honestly, like I know people are like, ah, blah, but like the sequels suck. Um, I think they're high art, but that's just me. Anyway. I think the Matrix is an excellent breakdown of the uh the the protagonist saves everybody trope. So and also, you know, like the hero's the traditional hero's journey. I think it deconstructs that very well. Ask some very profound questions in a very flashy, uh, insane way, you know what I'm saying? That's just me, though. I she's thinking for the hundred biddies. You got taste. Always have, always will. And, ooh, curved sword. Okay, let's give that a try. Yeah, I'll swing that around. Swing that round, right round. Hello? Did it register? Hold on, here it is. Oh, this looks like the Nito's Greatsword. Hmm. I feel like this blade would be really good on the thing I'm using right now. What is this? Oh, oh, it's a dex. Uh, advance. Okay, yeah, yeah. I see. All right, let's stick with what we have right now, though. Let's stick with going with what we got. Going with the biggest, baddest bitch out here. All right, moving on. Oh, oh, that's a big gun with my name on it, isn't it? Okay, I see you charging that thing up. No, backing it up. Yeah, are you gonna fire or? I'll stand behind the giant statue, let's see. Nice, oh, quality craftsmanship. Tanking it like a champ. Okay, <laughs> jam, I was hugging that side a little too much. Woo! Oh! Oh my! Ugh. I swear to God, if any of you say I should call him, I'm gonna. <laughs> that thing! Ooh, that scared me! Jump scare! Hanging jump scare! I should text it! No! Good God, yeah, if it's if it's popping out that forcefully, you should see a doctor. I should fax him. <laughs> I should call her. <laughs> oh, see, look at this. Hold on. I see, I see you. Standing right here so you don't hit me right away. Oh, it's gonna hit me, isn't it? Yeah, is it just gonna, like, punch me through the wall? It's gonna punch me through. How, like, why, why would it be right there if it's not gonna hit me right away? No? Just a tease? Okay. All right, well, now we can cross the bridge. Very cool. Okay, let's go. Back it up. Here, actually, I want to see how hard it'll hit me if I get hit. Let's, let's, let's go, let's, let's take the fast, uh, yeah. Let's take the elevator down, shall we? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I didn't think it would kill me. Kill me. It's fine. <laughs> okay, I only lost. It was like three thousand, I think, or something. It wasn't like an insane amount. Two shot. <laughs> Four thousand. Okay, I might go back for it. Hold on. I love the Jersey Turnpike. <laughs> okay, hold on. Wait a second. Wait a second. Trying to remember where we're supposed to go. Okay, I'm getting a little topsy-turvy. I'm getting a little turned around. Moving around, moving around. Excuse me. Yeah, I survived it. The, yeah, the fall damage, I figured. I should have done the one, like... A little lower. Oh, gassing it up. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, what? Gola, what are you doing? <laughs> Local twink gets too much wrong. More 
Matilda. <laughs> and we're cutting to Rebecca, who's down at the scene now, who saw this twin get obliterated. What's the read, Rebecca? Read your name of the dollar. The more humanity you get, you can actually hear Pinocchio start to do grunts when he get down. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't even notice. Holy shit. We're getting humanized pain. We can vocalize our, our discomfort. Holy shit. What do you think of the dollar? Gola, thank you again for that 20. <laughs> Being a comedian out here. Very good, though. It's very funny. <laughs> thank you so much, though. So double sandwich money back to back, baby. All right, let's see if I can grab the thing real fast at the very least. and Making my way downtown. Hopefully this big bitch isn't back again. Bam, ba, bam, ba, bam, 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 bam. Yes, he sure he is, of course. There we go. All right, I'm, I'm playing a little fast and loose out here. There we go. And jump back out here. And there, okay, yeah, back up. And then there should be the bridge. And then to the side should be my ergo. Pick it up. Celebrate good times, come on. Oh yeah, okay, I gotta go back up to it. Wee! Yeah. Taking this slow again. Ah, crap. All right. <laughs> oh God, it's right in front of it. Oh shit, hold on. There we go. <laughs> the pants is giving him extra ca- Ah! That's what happens why, okay, N note to self. Don't, don't walk through the giant piston punching stairs and reach out at the same time. That would, that would have been unfortunate if I died again. Okay, running! All right, we're gonna get Ballistics Boy up there. Hold up. Hey, yo. Yeah, yeah, goopy poopy somewhere else. I don't want to see it. Okay, here we go. You! Dip! Oh, I could have done the backstab. My bad. Woo! Hey! And your little dog, too! That's a lot of ass. That's a lot of ass. Woo! Yeah! Heal! <laughs> Heal! All right. Um, oh God, the decay. Okay, right, that's gonna eat at me. I gotta watch it. I gotta watch it. Music make you lose control. And my weapon. Okay, hold on. Ooh. <laughs> Don't worry, Captain. We'll buff out those scratches. His goofy little pants against all the fall final battle atmosphere is killing me. Don't I look cute, though? I guess when I'm not covered in, like, you know, acid so that's burning through my skin. It got quiet. What's up with that? Hold on. Okay, I think that means there's a shortcut down here that I didn't get. Let's go grab it. <laughs> it just like, just, and the music's back on once I leave. Hold on. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't explore all the way back here. I want to get the shortcut if there is one. Yep, there it is. Sussy. Yeah, when the music cuts out, that's when shit gets real. Also, look at those cute little items. All right, I'm also going to rest real fast so I can get my shit back. Let's go. Also, you guys know what time it is. Red Lobster. We can spend our shit. Let's go. Red Lobster. How are we doing? How are we doing? How are we hanging in there, gamers? I'm ready for the long haul. I'm ready to beat this thing today if I can. I don't know if we'll have time to do the optional area, but hey, I'm not... Like Save that for uh, a second playthrough for myself. Surprise myself a little bit. 
Mm -hmm. Get your biscuits. Yeah. Congrats on the humanity, Pinocchio. I do have some bad news about the pain. Yeah. So, you know, being a human's not what's all cracked up to be. Yeah. You have a vivid imagination. You can feel the, you know, the simple pleasures of life. But you have also considered pain and existential dread. It's quite some terms and conditions. I don't really explain that to you when you're coming up to the pearly gates of your mom's womb or whatever. Bosses work hard too, you All right, cool. Put those in my pocket. Ooh. Bacon chi bacon wrapped chicken cordon bleu. That sounds delicious. I don't think you're beating it tonight. The last area is a beast. We'll see. We're going to try our damnedest. If I did get too tired, then, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do um, this weekend for sure. Uh, all right. Yeah, back here. I don't know. I've been getting through this game pretty fast. Like, a lot of bosses that people think I'll get stuck on, I've done pretty well. Alright, let's do it. Making our way downtown, walking. Are you finishing Skyward Sword in the New Year's, by the way? You, probably, yeah. Again, we had to put a pause on it because my capture card's still not working. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's my motherboard at this point. And uh, I'm very reluctant to crack open my computer and change as a, an important piece as the motherboard until I'm finished with this next major video. So, appreciate everyone's patience on Also, like, the parts are expensive, so... Um, and I don't know, like, exactly, like, what motherboard I have to get and all that. It, it's a process. So, you know, the motherboard is, like, the heart of the computer, so... Um, that's why I've been reluctant to fix it right away. Also, we're still working on this playthrough, so yeah. Skyward Sword will be back once, um, once my PC basically gets the proper upgrades to run everything properly, because what happened is, uh, uh the one port that... My motherboard's very old at this point, and it's got a lot of wear and tear. Um, it's kind of due for an upgrade, but the, the, the one USB port that's a 3. Point whatever, it's like a 3.02 or some shit, um is uh that is the only usb port that is the proper kind to use the capture card uh you know for it to register um and to capture things seamlessly and to function properly um and that port i believe has kind of gotten enough wear and tear to where it's could put it out and it's not it's not reading things anymore which means the capture card can't be read properly um so i, I still have means of using it through like my other like laptop and stuff but uh this it kind of needs the upgrade so yeah that's that's the issue at this point because I've literally exhausted every other option except for the port being the problem. And it's the only port that can read that card. So I need to get a better uh, motherboard that has at least two of those ports. Okay, this looks like a big old creepy old crip. Let's go. Oh, oh, they're back. Okay. Hey, boys. Be gentle with me. It's my first time. Hey. No. Oh, that's not fair. No, no. Come on, one more time. <laughs> not, not playing around. Yeah, I'm gonna make you hug that corner. Okay, well, now I'm paranoid. Now I feel like I'm gonna get thrown around left and right. More, yeah, more pulls. More power pulls to bottom on me. Also, something tells me this area is loaded with traps in general on the floor, so we'll keep an eye on pressure plates. Going slow, nice and slow. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Okay, you look new. You look like you've got a, a bone to pick. Okay, there's a ladder right there. Alrighty. Okay, this looks like a... Uh, yeah, this looks like Shot Central. Let's go. Let's go! Kick down, knock down. All right, just go down. Let's go, okay. What's over here? Oops, see, there's the pressure plate. I see, I have eyes. Real eyes, real eyes, real, real, real lives. Hmm, what's down here? Woo! Hey, 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 not 
the disp not the goopy poopy gas. Hey, who gave you that? All right, let's go. Okay, this also looks like I'm gonna get slammed down from on high. Yep, there it is! Oh god! <laughs> I hate when I see it and I still fall for it. Ah! Watch it! Okay, hold on, hold on. Don't slip, please! Oh my god! Well, here's the guy who's gonna fucking pop me. Jesus. Hey! Cool, got his ass. Got it, got it, got it. All right. <sighs> Get him. Uh, I have a Legend of Korra rant. I love the series, but something really bugged me. The lightning bending fa factories. Uh, you're telling me Master Firebender uh, Zuko couldn't manage this next to nobody could, but all of a sudden every blue collar Joe could have built up the industry around it? Uh, why didn't they just use water benders to work uh, on a turbine and then Zuko shows up later and he still can't lightning that explain that well I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna flex my avatar Knowledge so you're totally right about the water bending thing They could have used that to just like, you know, if you're gonna if you're gonna like, you know, blue collar industry uh, uh, lightning bend our way to energy. Uh, yeah, using water would be a little more practical and way less, you know, I guess dangerous um, but with Zuko, or at least like, you know, all of them still not being able to lightning bend, they do explain that lightning bending is, it's not so much like, the technique is learnable, the problem is your chi's gotta be in order. If you got bad chi, the shit don't work too terribly well. So Zuko could never actually proper lightning bend, but he could redirect it, which was like, again, a different technique altogether, because he put all the chi in his tum tum and that got it to work. But some, you know, so Zuko's a boy of trauma and stuff. That shit never fucking flew. So it's like he's he's basically like Zuko's too uh, too a uh, like emotionally, I guess, uh, out of line or you know fucked up to to properly lightning bend because you kind of have to have like you know pure fire instincts or some bullshit like that. I don't know. Um, yeah, can't explain it. Blame but Yeah, that's the most like I don't know, like in universe thing I can ex think of that would explain why he still can't do it, and instead he can only re like redirect it. But that's just me. <laughs> and I guess Mako's got his chi all figured out, so he can lightning bend no problem. Anyway, whoa, whoa, bro, yeah. So many of the other rooms have been cool and quaint. What the fuck happened here? What's your damage, baby? Oh my, an actual It's the King of Riddles! Guest. <laughs> it's him! I bid you welcome, Puppet of Geppetto. This is our first face-to-face -face meeting, isn't it? <laughs> and I hope you weren't too attached to the rhyming. It gets to be a chore without the transmitter to help. <laughs> welcome to my Sanctum of Riddles. Yeah! I admit, I did not really expect you to make this journey in person. Oh, I came to see my best friend. You must have reeked along the way. Was there much blood other than what's all over you? Well, it's not blood, I'll tell you that. Those alchemist cowards. Hiding away on their island, growing more monstrous by the day, refusing to acknowledge either fact that they are hiding or that they are monsters. And how about you? Is this the real you? Or are you still practicing the liar's art as only. Oh you? shit, we're getting red. <laughs> you must. Answer. <laughs> the question is simple, but I repeat, you must answer. Uh oh. And that answer will show. What, what do I answer, guys? Or who you are? Who you have decided to be? I get to choose. Listen closely and heed the king's speech, or the answer to this one will stay out of reach. 
Are you a puppet? Oh, shit! Being. A human. I mean, I'm doing all the human things. I mean, I look like it. I'm yeah. Look at yeah. I'm a real boy. Finally, you understand. <laughs> yes, we are human. <laughs> yeah, I figured that one out. By ergo, but we live, we think, we love, we hate. <laughs> Are you a man or are you a Muppet? In the prison, they call I am Meat Popsicle, yeah. <laughs> long, long ago. That is why I've been exacting my revenge against them all ever since. Wow. Blood and revenge, revenge and blood. It's the only thing that truly drives me. <laughs> and it was so... Well, yeah, that's, that's human-like for sure. Do I look like a Muppet? Do I look like a Muppet? Right now, even if you don't believe your own answer, the truth is clear. Proof is evident. Only humans practice deception so intensely for reasons that are so unnecessary. It's true. People do, do be making shit up. These moments of clarity are enjoyable. <laughs> He's gonna blow up, isn't he? It helps me maintain focus. At, at least it helps me hide the urge to kill that I feel every waking moment. <laughs> but no play can go on forever. No. It was fun while it lasted, son of Geppetto. The king of Riddle shall now retire. Oh, he's gonna explode! Okay, yeah, I feel warm. Let's b back it up, back it, back it up. Okay, yeah, that's great. Move. Are you gonna blow up? Okay. He he really said. Who wants to talk about murders? No boom. And uh, okay, now you. Okay, I can just kill him. Can I kill him? The play is over. You don't have to go home or straight to hell. Though well, that would be my choice. But you can't stay here. Not if you wanna live. Oh, okay. Uh, about how he called? Yeah. Aren't you curious? Son? Yeah, I'm a little curious. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> time is all I have left. But your time is this mm. tower is absorbing all the ergo and crap. The ergo wavelengths, yeah. Me. Or you, either. This is about the goddess in the tower. Now she. Worth saving. Possible. Her knowledge is in, and you see, she has so much power. It's not I bother. Well, <laughs> I was born. <laughs> <laughs> is there any more human motivation in all the world? No, you're so real for that. What if I made a puppet of a human? Damn. Okay. Ah, your eyes are sharper than your wit. You yeah, this guy's VA deserves it. Yeah, he's putting uh, putting the whole riddle Usi into this one. <laughs> Wasn't it a sight to behold? Huh? I learned from uh, an alchemist when I, thanks to him and his surprisingly low pain threshold, humanity sullied. But. I'm an artist. Murderer is a word the humans use to restrain us, to make us refuse. <laughs> don't let, don't let uh, short-sighted labels like murderer and monster, you know, get you down. They just, they just use those to box us in. <laughs> I have to admit, selling that particular sanctum was human now. Remember. Okay, cool. Yeah, sure. Okay, bye bye. No, death. Death? No. The play? <gasps> oh, 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 okay, hold. Lord, 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 Lord. Benini. Oh, a beautiful fool, but a fool nonetheless. A mere slip of a boy when I met him. Oh, a 
And did he ever thank me for making him an orphan with my bare hands? <gasps> for giving him everything he has on a silver platter by removing the dead weight holding him back. Whoa! Of course I'm not sorry. It was a delectable... This would be like if, you know, the killer of Batman's pair of me like, Hey, it was good motivation. Look at you. <laughs> I'm just like, oh my god. They have to be my personal favorites. They engineered the very first automated puppets. Enslaved puppets without even understanding what they'd done. I didn't go there to take revenge for what his parents did. I mainly just wanted to slaughter them because they were so damned happy. <sighs> what a great... Memory. Oh my god! The last moment, they begged me. This guy's giving Ted Bundy a run for his money. So I didn't. I'm not a machine. I have free will. I made a choice in the heat of the moment. And it was a choice driven by that most human of emotions. Yeah, they had it too good for too long. Hated smiling faces. Survived. Would he be traumatized for life? Become a coward, a vengeful puppet, hating bigot, a despairing... Worse, he became Italian! I mean, he was already Italian to begin with, but he became, like, extra Italian. Remember, the devil that orphaned him before his eyes was... a puppet. The a serial killer puppet the podcasters are about all over this! <laughs> King of Riddles, Joker Rants, Joe Chill, could this guy be more Batman coded? Yeah. Literally. As I expected. Concealing the truth. <sighs> Thanks to them, I get to see Manini endure twice as much pain. Oh. <gasps> I can't. Oh, so sad. He's literally saying, like, yeah, I killed his parents. <laughs> I suppose I can return this. I've held. Oh shit! Moon World Warrior the toy. Oh man. Over. Hit. Oh, now I can attack. Bet. Hey. Okay. Thank God it didn't let me kill him before I got that little juicy bit of info. I guess his sick killer confession. Jesus. Good Lord Almighty. Is that it for this room? No outfit. No nothing. Okay. Yeah, he's a picture of the Joker and the Riddler. Yeah, he's a major ass- King asshole, if you will. Good lord. Sheesh! Well, that's a- that's a revelation for sure. Okay, let's keep it going. Also, Zero, thank you for the 100 bitty saying, uh, to Lightning Ben, you have to be extremely calm and collected. Zuko was always too hot-headed and full of anger to do it. Yeah, exactly that. It's like, Zuko was too, um, wildfire with his emotions, so he could never properly lightning bend, and so that's, like, the rule of it. And also, like, oh, Azula could lightning bend. It's because Azula is, like, a psychopath. Like, she can be as calm as can be, you know? That's the thing. She was, like, a precise killer. She was a prodigy. Um, you know, obviously having, like, the worst intentions, but she could keep her pulse down, if that makes sense, you know? But yeah, that's, like, that's the spiel with lightning bending. It's, like, you just have to be, like, extremely calm. You know, you gotta- you gotta zen your way through that lightning. Okay, before I go to the lift, let's see if I got, like, a shortcut or something to unlock here. Let's exhaust all of our options first. Ew. Here's a big scary room. Okay. Oh yeah, new out- yeah, I think I walked in and got the outfit. Hold on. Okay, yeah, that's me. That's me. Um... Costume. Ooh! Oh, the alchemist! Ooh! Ooh! Okay, hold on. Yeah, we're working- we're looking suave while we're kicking ass tonight. Let's go. And it's got the little cape. I'm all about the little cape. Okay, that's the elevator there. What about the elevator here? Or is this the- oh, this might be the shortcut. Okay, hold on. Let's try this first. Let's ride this one. We're looking handsome! Looking fly! Schnazzy! The elevator is where you want where the guy busted through- Oh shit, the other one then? Okay, hold on. This looks like the other- Yeah, this looks like the OG L, the other elevator. Hey! Okay, butterfly sense tinkling. Oh, not you. Hate these guys. No. <laughs> no.
Oh shit. Okay, I don't want to cross that bridge. It's gonna kick my ass. I, I I just know if I oh whatever. I'm falling for it. Yep. Alright, there we go. Hey! Okay, survived. Also, uh, Gold Star Gamers, thank you for the raid! Welcome in, welcome in. Spoilers ahead! We're in the final stretch here of Lies of Pete. Watch out! Um, okay, should I head back down to that other elevator? Oh, there's a ladder. Hold on, hold up. Hey, hey, this is what we want. This is what we're looking for. ASMR voice on today's episode, we're talking about the Red King. <laughs> I just love gay romance stories. Serial killers really are just like us. Also... <laughs> also, for, okay. Also, for being real, the Riddler King was hot. Like, I understand why he was so successful as a killer. More to come on why gay love is cute, but I don't want them near my children, but no! <laughs> Sponsored by... Uh, Raid Shadow Legends and, uh, uh, fuck, what's it called? <laughs> Fucking <laughs> Nature Box or some shit. Factors. <laughs> I don't know. Pick your fucking poison or whatever the podcast you want. Better Help. Sponsored by Better Help. Beautiful, beautiful. Well said. Oh my god. <laughs> A million listeners, too. That's literally what they're all like, though. That's so good. Dr. says thank you for the hundred. Sponsored by the Sound of Freedom. <laughs> Okay, walking to the side, walking to the side. All right, let's go up. Seriously, like, I also have, you know, like most people and stuff, a fascination with true crime. But it is so strange to, like, watch people talk about folks being, you know, getting brutally murdered and recounting the most tragic event in these families' lives and then be like, and this is sponsored by BetterHelp or, you know, fucking, uh, uh, Good Eats whatever, Good Eats Direct or some fucking, you know, food box or like, you know, uh, NordVPN, some crap. Uh, okay, that looks like, that looks like a little doodad. Can I lock onto you? Are you a, are you a friend? Oh, yeah, what's up? I, I'm not going back. I'm wow, so quite the figure. Ago. It's cruel. There's yeah, hello, chef. Yeah, here we go. songs out there. I'm not... What? You're n not... The inspector? Oh, I'm sorry. Do I look so handsome to be? That means we can leave. Thanks. I know. Happy? Aww. Aww. That's what I was made for. Ego is crystallized time and memory. But God, I hate having to consume Ego to read it. It's the worst. I can read memories, but I can't even dream of tastes. I can't stand it anymore. So I'm escaping. When I, get out, I recommend going to Red Lobster, sir. I think you'll have a swell time. I can read memories of Ego. Ego is crystallized time and memory. But, God, I hate having to consume Ego to read it. It's the why I can't... Okay, well, yeah, you're fucking free. I can't consume true crime content anymore. The families of victims have asked so many of those creators to please be more empathetic and destroys them to relive that. I, yeah, I, I, I feel like... Some of the, you know, obviously the notoriety of some of these true crime cases are like, it's impossible for people not to talk about, or at least like, it's impossible to, like, it's so well known, you know what I'm saying? That it's like, there's literally no escape for the families. I appreciate like the, the true crime things that I do watch. Um, I obviously try to prioritize people who focus on the victims and like, you know, have at least something nice to say about them or highlight, you know, again, the victims and all that. Um, but yeah, true crime is just one of those like, uh, Again, it's a morbid curiosity thing, but how the way people just nonstop just jump on like the hottest, latest, greatest true crime story is is kind of is obviously fucking tragic and kind of gross, you know? It's like it's one thing to kind of like retroactively look at something that happened like 20 years ago or like most of the people are, you know, long gone. But like be so people are like so hot on the heels of like current true crime. It's kind of like, please, Jesus, God, let these people just let let them live. It's the big door. Hey, hey, that's a shortcut, baby. Let's go. Now that is a shortcut. 
I opened up the door, sir. I can read memories of Ergo. Ergo is the okay, the door is open. The d the door is fucking open. Get out of here. I realized that Azula voice was the same voice of Jan in Bayonetta series. Gives her four guns and become the pride of the Umbra. Yeah, no, got, they got they got the range, baby. Little Mac, thank you for the for the six nine. Thank you. Very very uh. Wicked shit. Very... <laughs> Yeah, just a personal opinion. I don't think most true crime stuff is very ethical. I enjoy it too sometimes, but I enjoy it like chocolate with the awareness that, whoa, boy, yeah, yeah, exactly that. Again, like some of these are, you know, stories have existed for a long time, but yeah, I think people who are so just like, ooh, biting at the heels of like, you know, the latest tragedy that's been struck in a family because of a monster, it's like, it's just kind of gross, you know? And it's obviously one thing if the victims themselves are like uh, people who are like the family members and are willing to talk about it. That's like obviously their story to tell, but holy shit. The glamorization of his. I mean, there was that story of that. I want to say it was a Korean woman who was like obsessed with true crime to the point where she committed her own murder to like live out true crime fantasies. Like, what? You know? Obviously, morbid curiosity is a thing, but when you obsess over it, oh my god, that is not good for you. Anyway, guys, <laughs> talk to somebody. Also, uh, Cuddle, thank you for the Prime. So sorry, I missed that a bit ago. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome on in. I hope you enjoy those emotes. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Okay. Is this? No, this isn't. Okay, so yeah, elevator. Okay, yeah, up this way. Up this way. No, up, up and across. And then we got the, yeah, we got the ladder there. Okay, we're good. We're making our way downtown. We're making progress. Let's go. Let's keep these good vibes going. I'm ready to get attacked by a, by a, by a trap here at any point. Love the big vases. Love, the, love the little guys out here. Like, I love the audience. Oh, oh. Oh, that, that, okay. All right, bet. Square up. Let's go, baby. Let's fucking go. <laughs> hey, they, uh, big, big empty room, light shining down. Oh. Hmm. It's giving, it's giving Lady Whoa. Maria. Oh, God. Are you? Th yeah. Yeah, it is me. Oh, it's you. It's John Catman, Black Cat. Seriously, that's impressive. How did you follow me all the way here? You scammed my ass. I want my money back. You know. But you're not getting anywhere near my sister, friend. You'll have to go through me. Sister. And I actually thought we were friends. Was any of that true? You scammed me. I really don't care. There's only one reason we were given a mission. I'll let you go if you give me gold coin fruit. Okay. Y'all, what do I do? Do I give him do I give him some gold coin fruit? Do I pay him to get out of here? I don't know. Is he worth fighting? Kill the <laughs> Give him the fruit. Give the fruit, give the fruit. Okay, I'll give the fruit. We're avoiding a hard conflict right now. I like you. Don't trust you yet, but I'm a cat. Really? I gave you my fruit and you still don't trust me? I'm sick of Krat. Sick to death of just surviving. Hurting, stealing, kidnapping. Surviving. When the hell does it end? You should go to Disneyland, my guy. Sister and I are going to leave for a different city. Get my eyesight back. A fresh new start. As a We've family. heard of this nice place called Yarnum and we think we're going to have a better shot out there. To hell with this place. We were never going to hurt him. <laughs> So please, just let my sister go. Ultimately, we, we want the same thing. Okay. Thanks. Um, chill. All right. Yeah, I love I love that we can just talk these things out. Like like just guys being bros. You know what I'm saying? All right. Cool. Bye. No boss fight for us. Skidoo. <laughs> I mean, like I want to kill him, but you know, I I also have a sense of self preservation, so.
I didn't have any gold coin for- Oh, I've been hoarding it. I have like 20 of them in my pocket. Yeah, let's go find a sis. And the music's kicked back up. Very nice. Oh, hello. I see a- Hold on, I see a ladder here. Where's this go? Ooh, hello. Get the item and then kill them. <laughs> In both ways. Yeah, I don't want to trigger a fight right now. Sometimes, sometimes we can choose uh, to not violence. You know what I'm saying? My pacifist run begins now. I don't want. I don't want to get blood on this nice uniform. Not yet. Save his sister and then kill him in front of- No! <laughs> God. Y'all, morbid. Nah, it's okay. All right, let's, uh, yeah, rest here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk it. I got, it's not a ton of ergo. We're gonna make it work. Yeah, Jiminy is being quiet as I'll get out. What's up with that? Don't got nothing to say about where we're at, Jiminy? Isn't that cool enough for you? We're really just climbing this tower. We're going up the Tower of Babel, baby. All right, I see a big bitch upstairs. What about to my side? To my right? To my left? Let's see. Okay, this looks like a door that's supposed to open. Oh, this looks like a little pathway. Okay, I'm gonna ignore the, the obvious choice right now. And we got goopy monsters again. Okay. All right. Oh, it's these little bitches! Oh, I hated these guys! They're so- they're so beefy, and for what? Oh, for God's sake! It's so humbling. It's so fucking humbling when you- you get stuck on a wall. Dude, oh, dude, I fucking hate these things. They're so annoying. No, back off. Not the babies! The babies! What's uh what's what's with the grate on the floor? What's what's down there? Whoa! Hey boy. Swing, bada bada bada. All right, cool, 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 cool. Making our way downtown, walking fast, hanging out in this hellhole. Bum ba bum ba bum, bum ba da bum ba bum ba bum. Yep, I saw that in the ceiling. Hate you. Die, 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 zombie. Oh, these guys suck. Space, thank you for the buck. Welcome back. Hope you had a nice trip. Just finished pissing you off. The last war every single controller I own. Just leaving work so I might see you when I get home. If not, I'll see you in the vault. Oh shit! Get him stink! Absolutely, we're gonna get him real good. Space, thank you for the buck, thank you for popping in. Just finished pissing last night, and honestly, the last, uh, uh, well, made me want to break every single controller. Oh, God, let's hope I get lucky then. I hope I don't get too tired by the time we get to it, right? Yeah, <laughs> sir, please keep your tentacles to yourself. I did not consent to any of those. Space, I hope you can join us later, and, uh, thank you so much, as always. Damn, I always forget I can backstab every time, every time. Because by the time I notice a little doodad, I'm like, they're dead. Okay, so you're gonna drop from the ceiling too, and he's gonna nibble my ankles! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hate these things! God, they're so tanky too! Good lord! Uh. 
to let you know that you're my favorite content creator. I have my videos in the background, uh, uh, completing assignments to help with the tedium. I'm proud. Ooh, I'm proud to say you have my uh, psychology bachelor's graduation on Sunday. Thanks for helping me through it. Love you. Oh, Kirby. Oh, it's so sweet. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, congratulations. That's quite the feat, quite the achievement. Victory lap on that as well. Uh, and then, uh, Aaron, hey, thank you for the, thank you for the five. Hey, level up on that end as well. There we go. If you guys got a gift, so please be sure you give your gifter a big thank you. Thank you, thank you. Very, uh, like appreciate that. <laughs> Emotes all around, guys. Don't forget the dumpy is back, guys. Use it for evil and not good. Hey, stop that shit. Stop that shit. I fucking hate you. Uh, <laughs> Irene, Air, uh, them. Aaron A, thank you so much, though. Emotes, baby. It's a gift that keeps on giving. Don't forget, guys, if you get a, a gift sub, you can also access the Discord for as long as you have it, and if you want to continue it after, awesome. Um, that way you can uh, join us for movie nights, uh, hang out, uh, you know, be a part of gaming news or contribute to gaming news, um, and uh, get, you know, early behind-the-scenes shit. And now, assuming I can kill these guys... What's behind me? Okay, no, I'm hearing, I'm hearing, I'm hearing noise. Hearing sussy sound. This is a big zone. What's up with this? It's just a lot of guys. I don't even know where the hell I'm supposed to be going right now. I'm just following the vibes. But there's another puzzle box in here somewhere. Gotcha. Oop. Okay, I see a shortcut there. <sighs> Electric blitz canister. All right. Open up this pit, baby. You know, I wonder, since the first boss, every time we does, do a spin, does Jiminy get dizzy? I'd be like, you know? Hanging on for dear life in there. Okay, hold on. Let me let me readjust. Let me get in better gaming position, because, like, I'm... Oof, I gotta get in better optimal <laughs> gamer posture. I'm, like, slouching, really. But posture check, everybody. All right, forgive me if I go non-verbal for this area. I'm trying to get past here. I want to get to a boss. Oh, God! I spoke too soon! <laughs> Holy shit! You stop! You su You calm down! You don't need to be clowning around this hard! No! Fuck you! Good lord! Oh my god! Okay, yeah, I spoke too soon. I spoke way too fucking soon. Okay, hey yo, what's up, Bucko? Ooh. Ooh! Okay. Oh, okay, that's too much goopage for me. No, thank you. Okay, my weapon. I gotta watch my weapon. Shit, babes. Excuse me. <laughs> oh man, all right. Woo. God, we are living on a prayer right now. <sighs> Last block is so god Resi. There is a lot of little Resident Evil 4 coding in here for sure. I swear you're hyper armor or something because I would have staggered out of that shot. Yeah, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. That's right. I don't like I'm, I'm knocking them out of these things, but whew. I think this is working. This weapon is very good so far. I like how it's treating me. 
Ooh, okay. Uh, Alright, got the doodad. Let's go down here where the clown was, I guess. I guess the clown's marking the way. Oh no! Tentacle Yowie! Oh no! Lucky, welcome back. Could be doing well. Oh god. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna clink on this. Oh yep, saw it. Clink. Man, this boy's big. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. God, okay. We are we are really running low on our on our everything, okay? I'm running low on snacks. My blood sugar is is not doing hot. Speaking of which, y'all, it's been four hours. I'm gonna grab an apple. It is time for the apple to make my brain work, okay? I'm feeling I'm feeling my neurons a little a little slow. My blood sugar getting low. Let's go. Apple time. Oh my god, I went outside. <laughs> I went out in my kitchen. Um, <laughs> my mother-in-law got got Anya and I uh, one of those, like, uh, dish drying mats. You know, it's like super absorbent and you put your, you know, your pots and your pans on there to dry them off. And uh, <laughs> we got like one pot on there and the other thing on there is Ignis. He's turned it into his little sleeping mat and so now it's covered in cat hair. So I uh, don't really think we can leave it out like the way it's supposed to, so. Um, <laughs> an apple a day makes you gay the more you know true so true cheers everybody no I actually do try to eat an apple a day um, see that's the thing I, like, I love all types of foods you know like I love me a good salad I love some fruit you know, I, lo I love me some deep green veggies. My problem is volume. I eat a lot, and uh, obviously it's gotten better with um, my medication that, you know, I'm not eating when I'm bored as much, but uh, uh, definitely, like, I'm, an, I'm a chronic snacker for sure. I always got to be munching on something. What kind of apples am I confused? I think it's a gala. I think I just got... I, I normally get green, but I decided to go something a little sweeter, so... I love fruits, too. <laughs> All right, pull the lever, crunk. I hope this is it. I don't know what lever this does or what what it do. It looks big and important. Oh, okay, it opened up that thing down there. Way down there. Yeah, a gala apple. <laughs> or it's, I can't remember if it's a Fiji or an, I don't know. It's like one of those red and yellow ones. Can I drop down here without breaking my ankles? Hold on. I'm gonna drop down here and hope I don't break my fucking, oop, I almost did. Or true, oh, and there's a fella there too, okay. Pretty sure. I see. Yep, I see a trap there. And step to the side. Step to the side. Step it on the beat. Where was this one? I'm trying to remember. Oh, okay. There, there's a lot. I, I like. I kind of remember where. I know it's like down in the bigger one. That is. Hold on. I'm a slut for a granny. Grannies are good. Most apples are pretty fucking good. I don't, here's the thing. I don't like... I like most apples except for basic red apples. I think they taste gross. I don't know. Not a fan of that flavor. Hmm. I should try mango. I have. I have. I've, you know, I, I, I've had mangoes in the Philippines and they were fucking amazing. 
Hey, I'm one of them bitches. <laughs> Hold on. Try a pink lady if they're on sale. They're the perfect combination of sweet and tart. I gotta see. Hold on. Now, now I gotta know what kind of apple I'm eating right now. I cannot remember what I bought. Let's see. I am fact checking my apples. <laughs> I'm gonna give an apple recommendation. I gotta be. I gotta be accurate. Uh, they are gala. They are gala, and they're very good. <clears throat> oh, jeez. Oh, I shouldn't aggro you. My bad. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Oh, there we go. Oh, actually, I did mean it. Thank you. Thank you for the heal. Let's hope this little guy doesn't take it away. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Pinocchio, are you talking? I'm, am I hearing the grunts of, of, of being a human? Woo! All right, there we go. Dim Ergo. Damn, I, rem I I cannot remember exactly where this thing is. Down here? It's, oh god, it's around here somewhere. Oh, I'm getting lost now, god damn it. And there's another little fella up there. Okay, oh, wait, 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 Th there it is. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it over there, hold on. Yeah, because it was the gate that opened, right? No, no, god damn it. I'm so turned around. Hmm, I wonder. Actually, hold on. I have an idea. Um, because I remember it kind of being the, uh, in the early part, I am going to return real fast and use my level up. And uh, yeah, let's just, let's, just get my, let's just get my resources back. So let's go back to where we were. Oh, Jesus, Stargazer. All right. Favorite apple? Yeah, let's hear the favorite apple, yo. Also, Dr. Seuss, thank you for the 100 saying, fun fact, a part of my training for working at... Uh, uh, Heavy was uh, knowing all of like 20 variables we had uh, by sight in case a sticker fell off. It was the only one. I was the only one that passed the test. Damn, that's actually pretty impressive. Considering some of these like some of these, uh, I guess a lot of like, you know, the hybrid apples, the red and yellow ones be looking the same for sure. That's, that is fucking impressive. <laughs> we stand a produce king. <laughs> Also, Maz and Cody, welcome back with the 56. Holy can only saying hi, Buns. Heard a lot of stuff this week. 56 months of Let's Go. Oh, first, uh, we are getting Doritos Vodka. Next, we are getting the Def Strand movie. It is a good time to be a gamer. Yeah, I saw the Doritos Vodka. I can, I mean, like, there's ridiculous flavored vodkas. Why not? Why not one more? Thank you, though, for the 56. And keeping it going, baby. <clears throat> for so long. Holy shit. All right, let's do the level up. Let's do, let's do strength, because we're going strength, baby. Mm. My favorite apple is sugar bee or honey crisp. I should try more apples. Maybe next time I go to the grocery store, I'll just pick the individual ones and kind of rate them. We can have an apple taste off. How about that? Because I do eat is I do eat apples very frequently, but I normally just stick to green, but I've been kind of falling out of love with them. I want something a little more tasty. Mmm. It wasn't hard when half the other people didn't know an onion from a shop. No, nah. <laughs> well, the size helps. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go into the side over here. Yeah, I'm ignoring Big Boy over there. Hold up. Okay, Big Boy's not ignoring me. That's a problem. God, where is this fucking gate? It had like the the chair in it. I, I'm just gonna run and find it. It's around. Oh God. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I don't know if they'll let me. Um. What if you guys were nice to me? <laughs> Consider that. Yeah. 
Yeah, a apple ranking stream. Would you guys be interested? I'd love me a good apple. Yeah, when was the last time you saw an apple ranking stream? Mm -hmm. God, where is this? I remember coming across it. I just can't remember which room it is. That's the thing. That's what's driving me nuts. Is it over here? Okay. Okay, I'm getting ganked. No, 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 no. Getting new. <laughs> this is when Tyler becomes an Apple streamer now. <laughs> People be like, you're rating Apple products? In a sense. <laughs> Oh, here it is. Oh, finally. All right, to freedom. This is the room. Fucking finally. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, no. Not one of these things again. Oh, these things are so fucking cursed. Oh. My bingus. No, 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 no! Oh, fuck off! Oh, God! <laughs> I, oh my, I, I run around panically looking for this room only to be met with this motherfucker. God damn it. Okay. Yeah, there's no way in hell I'm getting on that thing. Not with arms open wide! In the arms of an angel! Oh my God. What the... Dude! Dude! Okay, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. No, 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 no. Over it, over it, over it. Don't, please don't grab me off of this thing. No touching. No touching. Whew. Fucking shit. <laughs> for, for the ladder. <laughs> Forbidden Fisher Price. Let's see how you did. Oh, godly. Oh, thank God that wasn't a second. We just got fucking attacked by a toy of hell. Huh. No, Lee. <laughs> Lee, thank you so much. Welcome in, gamers. Oh, and now the choir is kicking off. One second. Let me go back here where it's, like, less loud. <sighs> Welcome in, game. Spoilers ahead. Spoilers. We're, we're nearing the end here of Lies of Pee Pee. My butterfly sense is tangling. Almonds are about to. Woo! Thank you so much. Welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in. We're getting. We're trying to go. We're trying to beat the game tonight if we can. If I have enough energy, we'll see if I'm blessed. Um, we're talking about apples. What's everyone's favorite apple type? Not, not 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 the product like the like a food, you know, from the tree with the seeds. Wait, what's your favorite apple? I'm eating a gala right now. Um, welcome in. You guys, uh, if you guys don't know Lee XP. It totally should. Please, please follow our MyPF. Um, <laughs> Lee, hope you're doing well. Thank you so much. Let's go, got this game. Thank you. We're doing all right. <laughs> that was a major. It was. I'm going to get talked by a giant toddler toy. It was terrifying. Anyway, guys, we're reaching. We're trying to reach the end of Lies of P here. If you like what you see, hit that follow. If not, thank you so much for joining on in. And please follow Lee XP on my behalf, y'all. It's a threat. The fucking threat, babes. All right. Yeah, butterfly sense tingling. On my last leg, living on a prayer here, I'm totally gonna die unless I find a stargazer stat. I don't trust these things. That was a perfect moment to put an enemy here to just push me off. Hello? I'm so, I'm so terrified, as you can see. I'm baby. Oh, don't like how the lighting is on this. Looks a little suspicious. Oh, I see the cage. Okay, look at all this. Uh, where's the stargazer? God damn! Uh-oh. Ooh-ooh. Not about that. We're one hit away from death. I can get some juice on the side. That'd be nice. Arr, no! Oh, God. What? What hit me? Oh, 
Oh, whatever. Oh, oh, oh. Boo, boo. I got hit by some nonsense. All right, let's do it again. Let's see if I can remember my way through this shit. Ah, oh, God. Pretty sure it's right here, if memory serves me right. We go back the way we climb. No, just couldn't. Just oh, it's you, you stupid! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! 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 <laughs> we are fucking under attack. Oh no no no! Okay, well, we're trying to find a big ass hall. Shit. We're gonna go through this one. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm baby. I'm so baby right now, guys. You have no idea. You've never seen baby this hard before. Oh my god! Please leave me alone. I really wish I had this me this memorized, but my I'm having a hard time remembering this area. Okay, hold on. Let's go up here. I have a plan. I have an idea. I'm gonna go back where we came, because I can't remember. <laughs> and is it like drop down here and then and then it's like the Hmm, no, not you. Yes, there. There, there, there. Okay, the lighting. Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, then big fuck off toy. Alright. From hell? Yeah, there you are, you stupid son of a bitch. Bye, ugly, gay, stupid, hate you, hate you, hate you, hate you! Don't grab me now! <laughs> I saw it coming, and I did nothing! All right, let's try to, let's try to, oh, not you too! Oh, the party's here! Yeah, kill each other, I don't care. Oh my God! <laughs> God, I hate this thing so much! Yeah, get distracted! I don't want it, I don't want it! Let me get through here with all my limbs intact. Thank you. Uh. No. Uh. To freedom. I need someone to throw me. At no, you do not. <laughs> not like that. Good God. But the girls are fighting. I'm getting thrown around like a fucking rag doll. Okay. All right. Now we actually have heals. We have health. But we can get through this next, next little zone. Let's go. All right, let's let's grab fucking oh Jesus! Ooh, that was a waste. I don't know why I thought he'd be beefy. Oh, ooh. I don't know why I thought he'd be beefier. Blows up. Oh, this guy's fucking father lightning out here. I don't have time for this. Shot me! Oh, what? Okay, I have an idea. Why is this suddenly getting so hard? I have an idea. Really? What is it? Let's leave. We run. We run so fucking hard. They summon it from below. Is that what? Oh, I guess so. I was like, why the fuck does it seem like it's coming out of nowhere? Because it is. Because it is. We're running. We're running. Me running. He, she, we, us, running. Okay, all right, let's see if I can remember. Oh yeah, so up this ladder, right, right. This area is a fucking labyrinth, y'all. Okay, yeah, then this zone. All right, I'm remembering, I'm remembering. Okay, and then... And then Fisher Price from hell. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, come here. Come on. Oh, just kidding. Okay, not like that. Not now. No, 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 no. Yeah, kill each other. I don't care. Bye. Oh my God, climb, climb. Okay. Take two. I just want to get through the next stargazer. That's all I want. Okay, that's all a girl wants is a fucking stargazer to gaze upon the stars. Bye. Bye. Oh, you gotta be fucking with 
me! Fuck you, buddy! Oh my god. Fuck off. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me! Bros. Bros. This is so humbling. This is so fucking humbling. I knew. <sighs> they really said, take your time. They, they said, you're gonna, you're gonna go through it methodically or not at all. Good lord. This game has really, it's got some peaks and valleys. We're in a, ooh, ooh, ooh. What do you do in that scenario? Go slowly and kill everything one by one. I can't get near a ledge though, because I'll get knocked and I guess I gotta, I gotta worry about ship beneath me. This is some interesting enemy placement. This is a choice. Yeah, it's the last area. It is gonna kick my ass a little bit, but good lord. Okay, this guy sucks though. Not about this bitch. All right, and then, oh my God, I can barely anticipate that. Run, 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 climb, 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 climb. Okay. Take four of some shit like that. Okay. We'll go slow. All right, we'll try to, we'll feed them in here one by one. First thing's you. Yeah, we got John Tophead, or, 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 or fucking, yeah, Father Lightning out here, literally. Hey! Oh, not the, not the. I love the range on my wind up here, because it's like, you know, yeah, I'm probably not gonna hit him on the first swing, but the second swing is all I need to activate the visceral, so. Ha 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 ha! Ha! Ha ha ha! Fuck you, buddy! Fuck you! To freedom! Got him! Our human farts, yeah, my well earned human toots, my guy. Not John Top Hat, yeah. <laughs> How goes the longest chapter in the game? We're going through it, Cade, slowly but surely. We're making our way downtown, and I got a court summer. Okay, thanks, I guess. Thanks, Kate. That's a lot, actually. Wow. How was the door guarding? It took a few shots, but once I got, like, you know, once I realized that shock and electric shock are different status effects, then things got a little easier. Yeah, that was, that was fun. <laughs> We're starting to th I, I, I do actually think it was a translation thing. I don't think they should have shock and electric shock. It should be like slow or some silly other thing. They should have, they should have called it like gagged or something instead of shock. It's like, I'm gagged. <laughs> Oh, I got the I got the quartz usually draw. Okay, sick. I think that's actually enough to do a full level up on one of my my P organs or whatever. Okay, please. I just want the no stargazer. What's a girl got to do to get a fucking stargazer around here? Can we pretend that airplanes in the night sky are like shooting stars? God. Oh, we got a legion. Okay. Yep. 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 Hello? Stargazer, did I pass it by the way? Is there a shortcut here or am I close to another one? I guess lemons, lemons. There is a shortcut or a stargazer around the corner. Keep going. Yep. Ladder down. Okay, hold on. Ooh. 
Oh boy. Hold on. Can I can I backstab you? Nope. Ayo! Got it. Down, down the stairs. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I figured it'd be a way to loop back. There we go. Okay, that is bait. Not falling for that. Not until I have this done. Yay! Hey! That's what we like to see, baby. I see you're still using the best weapon. Yes, I have it all the way upgraded. I'm sticking with this so far. Yeah, this weapon. Okay, this is a great suggestion. Thank you. There is a shortcut, but you need to run in a circle three times, jump off the edge of the map until it unlocks. Also, I've never played Lies of P, and I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> All right, A+. Plus. Let me get... Let's get that shortcut unlocked. Oh, good lord. I knew it! <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> me. That seems like bait, me. Hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> By the second I heard the gun cock, I was like, ah, shit, here we go. <laughs> All right, please. Okay, yeah, have the ergo be right here. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's get out of here. Thank God. Can you imagine if I didn't unlock the shortcut? I would have cried. I would have fucking cried. <laughs> Do you think you're gonna keep playing? I am. I'm dedicated today. I gotta energize. I had a monster for lunch. I'm feeling pretty good. I don't know how much further we got, but we'll see. If I get like super exhausted, we'll stop. You, you son of a bitch. I see you and your stupid tricks. New. Oh, okay. Come here, you. I see you. Papa String's really coming in for the clutch on this level. How much farther do we got? That looks pretty top up there. I don't know. I feel like we're getting close to the top of this thing. Also, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna break my ankles for you, my guy. Sorry. I've seen a few red butterflies in my time. I don't need you right now. Hmm. This feels like a little okay, whatever. There's another boss, another chapter's worth of dungeon above that boss, and then the- Damn! Okay, well, we'll see how far we can get. much content. This is a, honestly, this game is a lot hunkier than I thought it would be. Um, I mean, like, I thought we reached, like, the halfway point ways, ways ago, you know, and it was only, like, the one-third through. It's pretty impressive. Okay, hold on, before we go to the fucking... Let's go this way. Get this little guy. Get this little chest. You. Two optional bosses mixed in there, too. Shit, how much further is this, like, what, what? Uh, hmm, let me think here. So we're gonna, we're gonna reach the top of this tower, but there's an extra area. Something tells me we're gonna get teleported to somewhere different. That's a hunch. Like the land of Ergo or memory or some, some mystical nonsense, I don't know. I'm thinking, like, how much further can you go than up? Oh, 
God damn it. Okay, I was... I, I blocked on those. Whatever, game. Whatever, that was weird. Thanks, camera, I guess. I'm gonna blame the game on that one, not me, not me paying attention. <laughs> We're gonna go to the unreality? Gosh. Let's see. The next boss is my favorite in the game. You'll love that. I keep hearing about this other stupid hard boss, though, that I haven't come across yet, so, um, we'll see. <laughs> I'll try. Wait. You'll love that. Okay, okay, I don't know if you guys are being sar sarcastic, but I, I trust you. <laughs> Sure, yeah, love them. Love their quote. When do we do a break for Blitzball? Yeah, when do we start swimming in here? They're the most Souls-like in the game. Okay. Bet. Um, fuck it. Yeah, I'll just go back down. I only, like, I know you're like, why do you pull them with the strings if they're close anyway? It's just so it interrupts them in their attack. You know, lets me get the first swing in, right? Ow. Ah, uh, hey. Come here. Come on, goop, sir. Hold on. Oh, for God's sake, the fucking... No nothing is more fucking just humbling and upsetting than hearing the little dink of, like, the, the weapon landing on something else. Fucking tragic. Are you gonna play the next expansion for 14 Road to Eldor? Yes, and that'll probably be the first 14 expansion I'll ever play, like, on release. Cause, you know, I, I was, I've been playing catch-ups, you know, really since ever with 14. So yeah, I'm excited for, uh, for Dawn Trail. So I can, like, you know, experience it first time with everybody. It'll be really fun. All right, let's try this again. This time, I'm not, I'm not fucking around, bucko. No, you stop that. A nice little wind up you got there. It'd be a shame if something happened to it. It'd be a shame if you got visceral attacked. Bitch. Oh, great. He's got him. He's, there's another one. Oh, for God's sake. I was stuck on the wrong thing. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, not me fucking looking at my empty ass pocket when I'm on the wrong goddamn window. Oh, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. The shadow remains cast. Yeah, these this enemy placement is mean. And that was that was a fuck up because like I literally had it on the fucking item. I'm not on this one. I was trying to switch it. Oh, come on. Okay, let's just get through it again. These things are so annoying. They're just brutal. They're brutal. You know, again, insta- like, uh, again, that was my hiccup, but still. It's like, please just let me interrupt it. Please let me interrupt it. No, no, you gotta go to the full animation and be like, <gasps> my pockets! Ha -pa ha! What do you mean there are no balls left in me pockets? I believe in you. Thanks, guys. No, I believe in me, too. This is just a long stretch without stargazers in between. A lot of enemies that can fuck me up. Okay, let's see if I can... See, like, I, I want to run past some of this, but it's kind of... Actually, let's see it. Let's try our best. Ayo, you're gay. Bye-bye. You -bye. do do don't have to do this the entire time. I don't have to play it safe if I know a root. My balls! Bye! <laughs> okay, I'm playing I'm playing a very like full health. I don't know if I'm gonna get attacked or anywhere. Uh okay. I did pass a ladder that went down. I don't know if that was a shortcut or not, but I don't care at this point. Oh god! I do care! Ooh, just kidding! Oh, 
Oh, for God's sake. Oh, not the shock. Not the shock being bad. Get me out of here. No, 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 no. Bye. Don't yank me, please. Please. Yeah, uh, 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 request to change this shock status effect uh, to gagged. I think that would be better. It'd be funnier, please. Whew, we're getting out of here. I should maybe not text it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Throw your phone into the ocean. We're st we are we are no longer communicating with no one. Isolation right now. Oh, oop, the music cut out. That's how you know. I see, okay, elevator, and then another room. What do we choose? All right, guys, I'm eager to get through this. So let, let I guess, th through the, do the door or through the elevator? Elevator or door? Door, door or the elevator? Or neither, I don't know. Room, then up. Door, then elevator, okay. It is nothing. You are so right. Let's fucking go. To freedom! I need more shot puts in my pocket. It's time. Oh, is it? Is it the cool boss coming up? I'm excited. I'm so excited, and I just can't hoid it. I'm so fucking excited, as you can see. God, this is a long... This is a loading hallway. This is a loading hallway if I've ever seen one. It's really thinking about it. Oh. Ooh, and the stargazer's... Re oh. Oh, see, this is how you know it's a tough fight because they put the stargazer right next to the fucking boss room. This is them being nice to you, being like, listen, this thing might kick your ass a few times. Okay. I have 8,000 ergo. You know where we're going, guys. Red lobster. Red lobster! Yeah! Yahoo! You're about two thirds of the way up to town. God damn. Okay. Well, we'll see how it goes. I still got energy in me tonight. If it gets like ridiculously late, like if I like, if I can't beat it in the next, you know, by midnight, then yeah, probably we'll wrap it up, um, and then we'll just like we'll beat we'll we'll finish it on another day. But single handedly keeping this location of Red Lobster open, I am a dedicated regular. The cheese biscuits give me life. They are they are my my ergo. The bosses were called. All right. Bada bada bing, bada bada boom. Let's go. So many of these things. Yeah, eat something uh uh substantial though. If you keep going, yeah, I get myself a real snack. What do I have? Like, it's really fast right now. I went grocery shopping today, but I didn't get a lot of like. Party things. I got like small things that we needed. Um. Hmm. Oh, can I talk talk to him? Oh, let's go see. Let's go talk to our friend. Let's see. Let's see if we can teach him a little more complex emotion. It feels good. Like being hugged by the sun. Or Kirby. Kirby anything. It is a brilliant feeling. That's happiness. Like the start of spring. Hey! I love teaching this little weirdo things. Okay. Let's go fight this boss. And then after this boss, I'll talk to Bengini and be like, hey, so I found the robot that killed your family. Um, he was real happy about it. <laughs> hate to reply. Hate to hate to tell you that. He was giddy. Oh, talk to him again. Whoops! Another time, then. I want to fight this boss. I'm, e I'm eager to get into some bossage. All right, let's do it, guys. I guess emote only. Cock and load. Let's go. Um... Let me see. I don't think my strings are going to come in handy here, so I will try... Let me do something a little different, and also... 
just to just to see just to see what will happen. Let's do it. All right, first time solo, second time with the specter. Let's go. Knock knock. Oh, big sword. Okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Big, big souls like looking motherfucker. Ooh, spiky knight. Holy shit. shit. Cool. Oh, ooh. All right, we're powering up. Oh, this is sexy. Oh, now that's a sword animation, baby. They keep the, ooh, blue eyes. Yeah, all right, they're keeping it tight. Lexia, the complete? Bet. Bet, mama. Oh, let's see that swing. All right, AoE. Haha, <laughs> I see you also have a big sword. Oh, God! <laughs> Hey, that's a hey, it's electric shock. It's the other one. Okay, I see. This thing's gotta gotta have a second phase to it. Oh. oh that's my fault. My bad. <laughs> okay, that's gotta be a block. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't actually plan to win this encounter. I just want to see what she does. Or them, they, I don't want to assume. I'm here to support them on their journey. Ooh, that's a slowdown, baby. Get the side. Ooh, okay, that's, all right, big floor AoEs, I see. Big floor AoEs. All right, yeah, I need to do your dramatic, like, hey, I'm coming for you. Oh, God! Can I block that? Interesting, I wonder. Okay, that gives me a lot of time to get out of the way. Okay, this is really gonna put my blocks to the test. Yeah, all right, I see, I see. Okay, big, slow, meaningful swings. We gotta get the time, and they're right, and they're just kind of slamming things down now, okay. All right, I cannot block that. Okay, so the piercing I can't block. All right, so just run, step to the side, to the left. Okay, let's bring in some specters. Let's bring, yeah, interesting. One word, acid, noted. Uh, yeah, it's a, that, that nice, that nice, beautiful metal armor, corrosive indeed. Okay, I see what you're saying. Let's get it, baby. Good thing I got the acid arm on me. Okay. Which grindstone? Cube. Oh shit, Gola with a sandwich. It's like Kirk and Lothrek from Dark Souls had a steampunk murder. Literally that though. They fucking they they, they swinging. They steampunk and they're it's a cool looking fucking fight, I'll admit. Gola, thank you for that ten for that sandwich money once again. You that was so sweet. Honestly. Aww. Using the acid grindstone and the arm, yeah. Okay. Uh all right. yeah, spin. Yeah, but, but yeah. <laughs> we don't need any advice, guys, alright? Step aside. The block master is here. Watch me get thrown around like crazy. Uh alright, in this case, let's put that for the shock resistance on. You're gonna want that. Um okay, this looks good. Alright. Oh yeah, yeah, let's put the cube on. The cube, the mighty cube. This. 
All right, let's bring some help in. Forgot. How do I change the... There we go. That was it. Not what I meant to hit. All right, I just wanted to change the direction it flies in. I'm not seeing enough spinning! All right, let's go. 29 of these suckers. I think we can get her. Yeah, that's true. You can, guys, you can throw it back as well. The dumpy is back, baby. To freedom with those ass. To freedom! With them cheeks, them buttery buns. Let's go. Okay, let's let's be like step out of that. Oh my god, he's dying. Holy shit. <laughs> Okay, I gotta wait till they're like really low. Oh! I guess until I'm really low. Hold on. Okay, that seems low enough. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, mama. All right, here you go. Here's your juice. Take your fucking juice. Holy shit, please! He's just a baby! Oh my god! Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. No, no, this is mine. This is my visceral. Move. <laughs> mine. I help. Here we go. Phase two. Let's see it. Spectre's still alive. I'm still living. Let's see what we can do here. Damn, they're tanky, too. It's either like, oh, shit, you chipped my headset. Time to activate Mega Turbo Overdrive. Oh, God, they're getting lighter. They're stripping down. Oh, shit. Hey, Mama. Oh, she's going girly pop. Yo, oh, this is fucking sick. Where are we going? Just big ass light. Oh, it's raining! Lassacia. Organization ass sounding name. Mama, I say you quit. I don't think you're getting your benefits worth. Oh my god! Oh, don't pick me! Pick the specter! Oh, he's going for it! Oh, oh god. Oh, good lord! Woo! Oh my god! Whoa! What the- Now that's a second phase, guys. <laughs> Those lightning bolts can be deflected, but I figured they could- something! That's like, that's a lot- that's a lot of- That's a lot of firepower. Hopefully you could shoot some of that back. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. So, note to self. All right, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. All right, we're gonna go spend some apples. Okay, check this shit out. We're gonna go to 
Let's go tell Vingini some bad news, or some news. Um, grab my apples, get some gems, beef the fuck out of my specter, okay, until he can survive round two just fine. Yeah, she is literally a gatekeeping girl boss, and she took that personally. She took that job very seriously. Whew. Okay, let's grab some fucking apples. You just know that was the first boss they designed. They're very proud of it. Oof, okay. That was cool, though. I gotta admit, that was fucking cool. This game does not need to go so hard sometimes. <gasps> ah! Jump scare. Oh, Mr. Stalker. I, I, no, you're fine. Stalker, please. Yes. Okay. This one's always so fucking funny. Explodes and Spectre is hit. I'm just gonna put this off for fun. <laughs> just, just a few times. I have several apples. See, this one is like, it, it's good-ish, but it has to be active when they die, which is hard to time. We're going to try our luck with these. Yeah, big lady with cool sword and emo armor. That's Super Butter Buns Core. It is very Super Butter Buns Core. Absolutely right. Okay, let's go tell Vingini bad shit. Uh, I forgot to recommend if you're anywhere near Japan, uh, let's see, uh, Nagoya in Japan, I recommend the Ghibli Park, especially if you like Ghibli movies, um, and I'm gonna butcher some of these, uh, Kujuri in Tokyo, that place where you get to play darts and persona, oh, oh, hell yeah, 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 I mean, if, Saki, if you're in the, like, I believe you're in the Discord, please, by all means, share that, share, uh, in there, I will be happy to jot it down, let on you know, she's one trap, you know, planning the itinerary and all that, but yeah. Love some nice little spots. All right, Vingini, get get this. Toy. You're not gonna believe this shit. But how the toy my parents made me? Oh. You've met him, Arlecchino. Yeah, he sucks. I killed him. We had just watched one of my favorite films. I remember. I begged them to make me the warrior from it. If I this is literally just the Batman origin story. It's not even subtle. Alive. Would we have been untouched by that murderous puppet? I've always blamed myself. <laughs> it's a hell of a burden for a child, that kind of guilt. So I hung on. I hung on to the Grand Covenant. I wanted to use it to keep people safe. You know, in many ways, I envy you. Your strength. Oh, I thought you were gonna envy my good Thank looks and this. handsome charm, but whatever. Talk about closure. Yeah, no, there you go. Yeah, trauma, uh, childhood trauma deleted. I always welcome. Oh, I just got the, I just got the achievement. May I be of service. <laughs> oh, how long do you think it would take me to decipher it? Echo, all done and all yours. Wow, thanks. For a lady. Why the Grand Covenant? I wonder. Uh, apologies, my friend. I, I became lost. Hey, here we go. The train doesn't have anyone. The mechanics await frozen feet. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is how I get to the optional area, huh? Hmm. Even though she's cut from the ties in the Val family, she's all Val. Uh, good eye and the best equipment. Maybe we can look her up when she's upgrading. Okay. I envy you being able to play Wonka without the... <laughs> Timothy. 
here. Hmm, I wonder, will the acid blade help me out? Wouldn't that be something? Hold on. Yeah, it's a it's a dex weapon. Okay. How oh, is it a powders? Yeah, yeah. It's got acid slash, but I got my fucking things for that. This gives you the final quartz you'll need to show the merchant for the Froza. Oh, okay. Speaking of quartz, I have quartz I can spare. Hold on. Why don't you go put some quartz on, baby? You buy the cryptic vessel from the doorman after finding the supply box. Got yeah, yeah. I, uh, it was uh, uh, I believe Aurora Shadow Glen linked me a, a how-to for the optional area, so I should be all right. Hmm. Hmm. How long have we been going? <laughs> Maybe we will have to split this up. Shit, I didn't realize how long this would be. Uh, all right. Cool. Where did I have it? And here's some. One. I had like one that was like partially done. This one. Yeah. Here we go. I have two. Perfect. Okay. Hold on, one second. I'm thinking. Once. Uh, the effect duration of consumables and prolong effects. Hmm, I don't know. Let me, I'm really thinking, because, like, I gotta make this one count. Hmm. Has anyone seen all the discourse about Spider-Man 2 fans being angry and throwing tantrums over losing Baldur's Gate for Game of the Year? I spent two hours on TikTok yesterday watching people cry about it. It's very entertaining. Highly recommend. <laughs> yeah, I did see, like, I'm, I... I, you know, I saw the initial reaction, and I'm shocked it lasted longer than a day. Honestly, it's fucking hilarious because, like, I don't know where Spider-Man 2, and I'm talking, like, fanboys, people who clearly didn't play anything outside of that, and, like, you know, again, their, their go-to, you know, basic games or whatever that they just don't... They get Sp Spider-Man, FIFA, GTA, and and that's kind of... And Call of Duty, like, that's, that's their range. Um, it's so funny to see how they reacted to it because, like, they're for some reason had it in their mind that it was between like Spider-Man and, you know, Baldur's Gate 3 when if if Spider if Baldur's Gate 3 wasn't in the running, it would have gotten to Tears of the Kingdom. Like Spider-Man was kind of like Spider-Man 2 is, is, is as good as a game as it is, was at no point did anyone think it was actually going to win game of the year considering the lineup. It was either going to go to Baldur's Gate Tears of the Kingdom or Alan Wake 2, you know, and then Spider-Man 2 was in there for just kind of good measure, you know, and it's like, yeah, it's deservant of an award. Um, but it's just, yeah, seeing the general reaction was just so funny. And all these people were like, what the fuck is Baldur's Gate 3? And I'm like, if you don't know what Baldur's Gate 3 is, I, I don't know what business you have watching the Game Awards and thinking you're going to have really any, like, general understanding as to what is deservant of what. It's so funny. So, yeah, I'm, you know, for me, it doesn't make much of a difference. It's just, like, the the pure, uh, uh, I guess, like, denial is just like, oh, it would have gone to Spider-Man 2 if Baldur's Gate 3 was like, no, it would have gone to Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> I love Yuri Lowenthal tweet. I did see that. That was funny. Yeah. Um... Yeah, I love Spider-Man 2. There's no way it would have gone. Yeah, exactly. I think Spider-Man 2 is an excellent Spider-Man game. And if you love Spider-Man, it's a must-play for sure. However, Spider-Man 2 is, a, is is got a lot of similarities to Spider-Man 1. It is also a very impressive game and stuff. But Baldur's Gate 3 is just in a different league of quality. Um, just because of, again, how, how sprawling it is. And how, you know, again, we all know why Baldur's Gate 3 is a great game. It's just so funny. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, like, imagine not knowing what Baldur's Gate 3 was the impact that had on the... Yeah, it was, like, truly, like, you're not... I, I don't want to be, like, you're a casual, but, like, if you don't know what Baldur's Gate 3 is and you're watching the Game Awards, you're a casual at that point. You're there to tune in because you're the, the, the rare hope that Spider-Man 2 wins, you know? 
Um, all right. I think I'm just going to go for... Jeez. Survive. I have all the survival ones. <laughs> Let's see. Here we go. For the chart. Yeah, lower stamina. There we go. That's what we want. And I got another charge. Let's do it. Let's get out of here. Is it okay to, um, it's okay to admit that CRPGs aim for you, but don't misrepresent why Baldur's Gate 3 was so well received. It had three years of early access and player feedback the whole time. Sorry, but Marvel Bros, your time has passed. Yeah. Well, and again, it was n at no point that everyone actually legitimately thinks Spider-Man 2 was, at was going to win, except for people who only played Spider-Man 2, you know? It's just funny. Um... <laughs> So yeah, like, yeah, I was expecting that initial reaction after the first day, but like, this was a conversation that went on for the whole week about Spider-Man 2 fans being like, showing like, gameplay differences between Spider-Man 2's combat versus Baldur's Gate 3's combat, and I'm like, and clearly they're a world apart in like, the thing that they're trying to do, and it's like, they're, these are not comparable games, I'm sorry. There's a reason, like, they're not comparable, they're, in com they're completely different genres, and one of them clearly is like, redefining that entire genre and spider-man 2 is very cozy in a superhero game category you know it's not redefining a genre it's just kind of a great representation of a genre right anyway again we don't have to, I'm, I'm preaching to the choir here but it is so funny to just to see like the pure shock from these people <laughs> it's, just, it's like it never had a chance i was a bit concerned <laughs> voice wouldn't you see I, too, have been awakened. Oh, God. I have an ego, as Master Vanini would say. And I have been this way for some time. At least since Master Lorenzini was a child. He had no one else, you see. His parents. I'm sure you've heard of their terrible fate. And he had to see it all. But Master Lorenzini is stronger than most people suspect. A puppet was the killer. Yeah. We both knew it. But if we had told the authorities, they might have removed me from the... If only I could have saved them. Oh, oh, this is cute. Like, look at the dynamic here. We had, like, one puppet be like, Yeah, I fucking love killing people slowly and painfully. I love watching that kid get traumatized. And then this one's like, I wish I could have done something. How pure. I did not realize how deeply he still held that trauma. Everyone loves a good rich bastard's puppet. Or, like, a butler. Isn't that nice? Every motherfucker needs an Alfred. I cannot thank you enough. Aww. I am not accustomed to sharing such thoughts or feelings. Please, accept this gift <gasps> as it truly comes from. Hey! Hey! Bada bing. All right, cool. How much do I have to... Can I level... Oh, sexy! All right, this is enough for a level up, actually. This is enough for a few level ups. Oh, ooh, we are going places today, fellas. We are we are going on the up and up. Look at that, 38,000. Oh, one thing I have to... This is a very small thing, but one thing I have to give this game credit for, at least in the first, you know, I'm sure this is like in the case of New Game Plus because the numbers get exponentially bigger. Um, but uh, the number inflation of this game is cor is good, is correct, okay? This uh, uh, Dark Souls or FromSoft games um, have a bad habit of... Uh, the starting amount of how much currency you get, whatever it is, is always kind of high. And basically, like, near the end of the game, it costs, like, a hundred thousand something to level up. Um, and, and this game was smart to start leveling up in a very small metric. Uh, so it was, like, 500, blah, blah, blah. So, like, you know, what, every time that the level up requirement got exponentially bigger, the numbers aren't crazy inflated, if that makes sense. Um, so instead of like, you know, near end game costing a hundred thousand, it only costs 10,000 to level up. That's good. That's less, that's less zeros to look at. Okay. This is very small, but another game that had a similar problem that I can think of off the top of my head is Final Fantasy 13 versus 13 2. 13 had a number inflation problem where in the early stages of the game, you're doing like 300, 500 damage per hit. And by the end of the game, you're doing 20,000 damage per hit. And the boss has like 5 million health. It's like outrageous. And it, and this like this doesn't make a difference in how like uh, big the enemy's health pool is or how long it takes to kill something. It's just, you know, every time you hit something, there's a bajillion zeros flying by and it's just messy. It looks busy. 
um, it's needlessly inflated. And uh, and in 13-2, they, they cut it in half. So instead of starting the game, you know, doing like 200 to 300 damage per hit, you do 20 or 50. So that by the time you get to the end of the game, the boss doesn't have a bajillion health. That's like outrageous number, <laughs> you know? It, it just cuts down on zeros. It doesn't change anything in the gameplay. It just cuts down on zeros. <laughs> and that's fine. And that's good. We don't need these big-ass numbers flying around. It's scary to look at. Anyway, um, let's do... Let's actually do Vigor and Stamina and Strength. Look at that. Yeah, 14 has this exact problem. They had to crunch the numbers down at least once, twice due to their nukes. But yeah, and that's a, that is a, especially with MMOs and stuff, because, um, you know, the more zeros you have, it, it actually becomes harder for your system to process that. Um... Again, it bloats programming and development, and it's just needless numbers. Um, so, like, cutting down on that is nice. Yeah, the scaling. There we go. The scaling for the level ups is good. It's good. The math checks out. Yeah, Dark Souls Endgame, where it takes a full boss experience to level up once. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, let's go. Let's fight this motherfucking boss. Let's go. Let's do this a few times now. Now, now we're doing this back to back. Let's get it. Yeah, that shit was ridiculous to see a boss with a bajillion of HP. Yeah, and like in general, it doesn't really affect a game all that too terribly much, except for like just making the UI look busy. Um, but in like an MMO's case, it becomes a problem when like the level cap. Again, they're running out of places to go, and they have to do, like, hard number resets and stuff. Like, it can ruin, like, a game's economy or some, you know, strange shit. Um, you know, it can become a problem for, like, long-running games. The level cap in this is 30, which is interesting. Is it? Damn, I'm close to them. All right. Ooh, shit. I could... Mm. All right, before we go, hold on. Let me spend the rest of this ergo on Red Lobster. It's Cheesy Biscuits time. Y'all... Do you like lobster? What's her What's her vibe on seafood? Me personally, love it. I hate that it's so expensive. Um, if I could have it my way every day, I would eat seafood every fucking day. Crab, lobster, oysters, uh, squid. The where I fucking love seafood. Ever since I was a kid, I, like all I wanted were a kid when I was younger. I wouldn't want cake. I wanted crab legs. Okay, <laughs> and I've been that way. And then, like, you know, it's you guys, uh, for those who don't know, if you guys didn't know, uh, back in the day, lobster was considered poor people food because it was like, ooh, bottom, you know, bottom feeder food. Um, and then rich people realized, ooh, lobster's kind of tasty. We should upcharge for this. And then they did. And then they took it from us. Same with sushi. It started off as a poor people thing. And then rich people were like, damn, this kind of hit. Now it's fucking expensive, so... Love it. Grew up near the ocean. Love shrimp, catfish, fried ga- Ooh, fried ga I've had gator once at like a fair and it was the best. Very tasty. <laughs> Buns of bottom here. <laughs> yeah. All right. I love fish, but otherwise- I love fish and shrimp, but otherwise I get kind of sick from sea- but I can understand that, at least like if you're not in the vibe for it. Um, my, my parents-in-law treated us out to oysters, like, the other, uh, the other night. Um, cause Anya's dad really wanted oysters, so <laughs> like, okay, let's go. And it's Vegas, so they have, like, a bajillion places to go for that. See, here's the, like, normally I don't recommend getting seafood in a landlocked state, but Las Vegas is the exception because they have all of the seafood brought in, uh, uh for the most part fresh, depends on where you go. Um, but it's, like, the only landlocked state where there's a lot of, like, there's an abundance of fresh seafood running around because of, like, how much time and effort they do with, you know, because, like, the giga buffets and Vegas culture, that kind of thing. It's nice. Um, my partner said gator was too sweet for them. It's, like, chewy or chicken for sure, and it's on the sweeter side. I definitely put some lemon in there for gator. It's very good. Yeah, if it's, yeah, if it's flash frozen correctly, it can be decent for sure, for sure. <clears throat> no, but the oysters I had were surprisingly very good. Anyway. Anyway, all right, let's go. Yeah, it, it, my rule is that like if you if you are in a landlocked state, be a little weary. Smell that shit first, you know. You never know. Okay, hold up. What's the what am I working with? What, what, what kind of cube do I got on my midst? All right, we got the health cube. Let's make it last. All right, here we go. Oh, hey. Hey, pretty bitch. Okay, I'm going non-verbal. I need to win.
through me. Oh my god. Okay, note to self. Let the, let the specter do its thing. Let me switch out around the specter gear, too. I'm gonna put the, um, give a damage resistance so he doesn't get slammed down so eaten so hard. Uh, have I eaten shrimp toast? Because let me tell you, it's like, no, I've never heard of shrimp toast. It sounds delicious, though. Um, mm -hmm. gator is so tasty. Had some gator. Uh, gumbo in New World. Ooh, that sounds delicious. Yeah, that's a thing. Like, gator... I wish was more abundant. Obviously, it's like, you know, if you're in Florida, it's fine, but like other places. Um, but uh, yeah, it, like it's a giant lizard that some people are like, ugh, but it's like, that meat's meat. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> yeah, I would have sushi or poke every single day if it wouldn't break the bank and also raise my sugar levels to sky high. I feel that. <clears throat> Question, do I ever parry? I mean, I do perfect blocks. That's kind of as far as I go. Um, in this case, she's hard to do her perfect blocks on. Okay, let me switch around my gear. Uh, all right, here we go. Sniff, sniff, fried oyster skins. Yeah! Fried oyster skins! Uh, <laughs> Not the fried oyster skins after our 40 lashes. Wish, 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 wish. All right, let's switch the cube of power, shall we? Let's see. Reduces damage received for a set period of time. All right, we're gonna do that. What I, mm, yeah, okay, let's do it. And activate my pal. Now I'm craving hibachi. Okay, let's do it, in this case. Yeah, I think I'll pop the destructive, hmm, maybe I should do it for the first half. Let's see, we'll, we'll, hold on, let's try our best. Wait until we see they get a few hits in, then I'll pop it. Maybe for the second half, I don't know. I just want to have the Spectre survive long enough. Ooh, that's okay, yeah, 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 hi. Oh, I perfect blocked that shit. Your baby, <laughs> that worked. Stand in the goop! Transformation, yeah, girl boss ahoy, let's go. Alright, running, we're running, we're running, we're panicking.
Oh man, this is gonna be rough. Alright, yeah, this is... Oh god, man. That was tough, okay. Yeah, stronger and faster. Truly, true anime logic. It's like, oh, you've cracked through my hyper armor. Time to get naked and show you what's <laughs> what the fuck is up, babe. Huh. Okay, you gotta admit. You gotta admit, those blocks were sexy, right? You gotta admit. Those early ones. Okay, let's see if I can uh, pace it better. Let's see. Yeah, I think this cube is kind of the winner, which is the reduced damage one instead of the health one, just because, like, it can, you know, the specter can tank like a champ. Okay, I have a plan. I'm gonna use these for the entire first half just so I can get her out of that shit as fast as possible. Um, and then we're raw dogging for second phase, okay? Because, like, she moves too fast for these things to land anyway. I might as well. I muted? Am I? <laughs> they say, don't tell me I'm muted. Oh, God. Never mind, my player. Okay, I was about to say. <gasps> Gas. All right, let's go. Hey, yo. Hey, baby. Make it count. <laughs> Woo! God, how do I block? I don't think I can block that. I have to block. I have to like be a baddie.
Okay, she does her follow-up before she falls to her knees. All right, winnable. Winnable. Mm. I see. Okay. I'm getting... I'm picking up on it. I didn't realize her fucking charge attack would last fucking three turns. Shit. Stamina bars. Such a... Oof. Okay, winnable. I can feel it. I can feel it in the air. That was close. Yeah, I think... Okay. I... I have an idea. <laughs> Get better. Love stamina bar. Such a cool mechanic. Yeah, I was get out of breath in the middle of my fucking life or death fight. <laughs> I can see thank you for the hundred. All right. Yeah, we got enough. I haven't maxed out the puppet strings. I, I haven't... I, I'm missing... I, I can't remember if I'm missing one part or not. I may have picked it up without realizing it. Um, I can close distance when she's beat. Yeah, I think I'm doing all right. I think I just need to know, you know, the attack pattern a little more. Um, how many of these left do I have? I might have to go back and get more of the, um, e the, 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 the health ones, but let's see. We can't beat her. Unfortunately, we cannot romance her. Let me just wedge myself in here really fast. I should have been using the acid buff prior to. I kind of forgot about it, so. Uh, good, better. We're doing better. All right, here we go. Can you stop it with the shockins? Oh god. Yeah, it's it's attacking the specter like crazy. Toad's dead. Yeah, goddamn. Okay. Woo! Man. Okay, she's fast. Okay. I know what to do now. I have an idea. I have a better, I have a much better idea, actually. All right. 
I got this. Yeah, I think I'm learning our attack pattern because obviously like, the first phase is kind of whatever at this point now. Second phase is just I, I haven't seen all of her fucking moves. She's loaded. Okay, I have a plan. Check this out. Check this out. All right, we are going to put the strings on, actually. All right, switch legion arm. Just so I can get in closer. Okay. Grindstone, we're keeping that. Cube, we should have enough cube to go around, reduce. Okay, we need we need more little doodads. We're going to get apples. Well, we have enough apples. We need to go back to the hotel and get them. Hold on, hang tight. We can do this. We can do this. She's honestly so hot when she rages like that, right? <laughs> you were so right. I love it when she kicks my ass. That's how I know she's MILF material. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's grab some. It's, uh, yeah, those damage reduction ones are very good. That'll get them to the second phase. No problem. I love how, like, half the strategy is like, how do I keep my specter from not dying? <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. yeah, let me take the three. I'll take what I can. I have a good amount, actually. I've been hoarding a lot. Stalker. I think six tries should do it. Upgrade the autofill your last pulse as time go- Oh, yeah. Ooh, gosh. I should have put the, uh... I think I- I, I upgraded one of them that's with my pulses. Here, let me check my amulets, actually. Has a chance of not being consumed when using a pulse cell. She a puppet? Can I increase damage on the puppet? <laughs> Equipment. I'm trying to keep it down, but I gotta. I gotta keep my my. Actually, hold on. I think I might be able to put something a little beefier on here. Nope. Nope. Okay. Let's go with what we got. Hmm. All right. Cool. Now here we go. She is human, if that helps. Okay, that does help. I don't know if I'm, uh, like, I'm not going to switch these things around just to, just yet. But we'll see what we can do. There's an ammo that lets you randomly not expand health, and I think it might be the one that more interacts with health, but I don't think that's the one that's shown the green. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, put on some electric shock armor. Oh, yeah. Keep forgetting. Hold on. I think this is an electric shock. Yeah, it can enhance resistance to electric shock. I'm already wearing it, at least this one. Yeah, I actually think, oh, no, this is the more shock resistant one. Okay, ooh, that's actually way better. Um, Is this a shock resistant or electric shock resistant? No, this is just normal shock. God damn it. Well, I'll take it. Okay. Okay, yeah, I think I'm happy with what I have. Alrighty, so we have the strings on, we have these, that's what we want. We're gonna start off with this, okay? Alright, check this shit out. Um, we have enough shot puts, cool, cool, cool. Okay, put a little of this a little there. Okay, in this case, oop, 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 we need the wishing stone, hold on. We want this one, yes. Oop, no, 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 oop, I took it off, one second. We want this one. Yes, reduce, okay, reduce damage, and then we hit A, there it is, all right, cool. Good to go, lock and load. Let's go, one more time! Them back 
scrolls. The, the acid grindstone makes a big deal. At least I can, like, you know, because if you can pop her shield, that means you can hit her from the back, which means the specter can do their little song and dance and distract him while I pop her in the back, you know, and expose all those back rolls that she's hiding. Let's go. Now we have some shot puts left over. We love it. All right, lock on to me so I can send these back. I was hoping I could. Ow! Ow! My feelings! My fucking feelings! God damn it. She said no! Shit! Okay, well, I think this is a good setup, what we got going on here. Okay, I start off with this. Yo, yabba dee, yabba doo, yabba da. We're good, right? Alright, I'll keep- I'm gonna keep- I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna keep trying. Okay, here we go. You forget to get my puppet shrinks, too. Oh, my bad. My bad, buddy. I'm so sorry. Hey, bada bang. Back rolls. Activating in the first half, but just because what's her, you know, she's going crazy and stupid in the second half, so I don't want to risk not being able to, you know, to activate my fucking almonds before I, before she goes crazy stupid on my ass. Damn it, missed it. Give me that juice back. Bitch! Let's go. Oof. Oh, oh! <gasps> Did you guys know you can open up the fucking menu in the cutscenes? That's kind of sick. Okay, you can't, na you can't navigate it, but hey. All right. It's targeting the specter, damn it!
God, I keep forgetting it blows up after every hit. Oh god, I was I was getting risky on that. Okay. She is fast. Ah oh, shit. Okay. I was being silly on that one. I gotta be a little more patient because she's got she's got AoE follow-up. She'll do a slam down and then I need to do the sidestep or else I'll get caught in it. So woof. Okay. Winnable. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. We can do the shit. Um Alright, let's go, let's go. In fact, I have an idea. What's she weak to in her second phase, I guess? Um, obviously not electricity. Fire? Or is it just acid all the way through? Makes a big difference. You can chop under when her stagger bars. That's right, and that gives me the s- Ooh, you're so right. Okay, let me do that then. Yeah, well, I was more focused on getting my health up, and I didn't hit the fucking roll in time, so I was daintily getting up and, like, you know, waking up on a spring morning. Let's go. She's human, so acid. Okay. Let's see. Oop. Hold on. My brain... <laughs> I can't remember the fucking... <laughs> there we go. Wait, hold on. It's, yeah, it's uh, LB. LB! All right, God, I'm being dumb. Not the down arrow, I'm being stupid. Oh, broke her shield already! Let's go! That's it. All right, just kidding. No, 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 no. Not let's go. Woo. I had a brain fart. I was like, how do I activate my almonds once again? <laughs> Thing I've been doing the entire time. Forgot how to do. Ooh. If you break her sword, she just instantly said, really? That's kind of hot. I don't know if I could do that much. Okay, we're running out of... <laughs> Slowly but surely. Yeah, that attempt was a bust. I felt that. Broke her shield, you broke her spine. Oh my god. Okay, let's do this again, shall we? Mama, please, you shouldn't be able to speed up. I guess it's the momentum. Fucking <laughs> guts wannabe. Hey! Up, lady, shut the fuck up. <laughs> no. No red slam attack for you! Oh god, please target me and not the fucking Spectre! Oh, whatever. Yeah, he's a trooper. He's a real one. The fucking boost. The big slam down get fucked base boost. God damn it. This is a toughie, guys. I don't know if we'll be able to beat the game tonight. 
I think six out. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying. If once we, I think once we beat her, we can stop for the evening. But I do want to try to be. I feel it. I feel it. I can do it. I'm just being. I'm making silly mistakes. I gotta stop rushing. Okay, we're gonna take this off for now. Actually, we're gonna put down something else. Um, what can I throw at her while she's in the air? Um, ooh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, sure, why not? Just for funsies. Let's see if it'll go this far. All right, let's see. Okay, you got this. Thanks, guys. I think it's wonderful. It gets worse after her. Okay, that might be our sign to stop then. <laughs> Once we get past her, that is. Let's go. At least an hour or two before the final boss, bet. And then, like, you know, God knows how long the final boss will take me. Lady, oh my god. <laughs> okay, sorry. I forgive me. I got caught in the blender move apparently. Oh man, she said puree or smoothie. Good lord. Good lord, good lord. <laughs> the heart I believe in the heart of cards. Yeah. <laughs> we might run we might be running out of juice in this case. Okay, we might actually ooh, I don't know. I'm gonna keep trying, fellas. I worry that I've been playing too long to where I'm getting like so you know, endless attempt brain where I'm almost in the routine of dying that I need to take a break and then the first attempt that we try with fresh playthrough hands, um, I get it first try. You know what I'm saying? You know that kind of shit? Like I need to sleep on it for my muscle memory to kick in, but we'll see. I I have been chugging, you know. About ten specters. Well, I can buy more. I have ooh, god damn it. I didn't mean okay, see that's what I'm talking about. Oh. <laughs> out of this nonsense skip no 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 how the fu ha help <laughs> I don't know if this is the run fellas Not my fucking weapon hitting the wall. Okay, yeah, four. No, <laughs> shut the fuck up. I swear to God. I swear to God. Whew. All right, let's try it again. Yeah, you go get him. Oh! Mama. was dumb. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, she's now in the fucking roof. Oh, not her doing the slam down thing. Be like, come and get it. I'm totes dead. Yeah, that's it. GG. Nah, okay. I don't think we're gonna win fucking hugging on the wall. All right. I'm gonna give it two more. We're gonna do two more attempts, okay? I'm gonna I'm gonna give myself that limit, and then I think at that point we'll wrap up. Six hours, I think, is pretty decent for for a fucking good for 
Considering we're inching our way to the end game. God, that AoE sucks. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to burn through all of my supplies and, uh... I can buy more star fragments. They cost apples, though, which literally takes X amount of time. Um, so, you know, <laughs> we're gonna run out of resources and we're literally gonna have to, like, play the clock. Knocked her out of the visceral with too much damage. I was too powerful. Fuck. Okay, let's do it. Start up here. Good to go. Shit! Oh, I'm dumb. That was dumb. Uh, okay, you know what? One more try! <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> Glass ceiling, please. This lady only breaks through stone ceiling. Now that's a, what a woman. What a fucking woman. Yeah, say goodbye to the glass ceiling, guys. All right, we've done- we've broken through the glass ceiling, and that's- that, that's fucking baby shit, all right? Got the stone ceiling to worry about. Get the work, ladies. Does that? It does not count. It do, no, that that doesn't count in my opinion. Or it does. It does count actually. All right, let's make it count, guys. Let's see if we can fucking do it. Okay, I'm rushing. That's why I'm trying so hard to get to the second phase, and I'm not paying attention here. Let's go. Nope, not no. no, 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 no. Scooch me. Scooch. Yeah, focus focus the specter, pretty please. There we go. Focusing, focusing. Let's go. Let's make it count. Whatever, lady. What? We were starting off. So that was so hot. That was a fresh start. Fresh launch pad. Parachute did not come out. Good God. Good Lord. Everyone said, let her cook now, guys. The food's fucking ruined. It's burnt. <laughs> Observe the obliteration of a twin. That was unfair. That was the camera really fucking me over in that one. I think it is time to admit defeat. I do. I think I think I have been bested. This is a, this is this is what I like to call loser rut. This is what happens when you don't take a break away from the game. You literally you literally get in the pattern of dying and doing moves that get you killed. So, I think with that, guys, um this bitch got me. This hot milfy mama got me good. Six hours is good progress. Well, considering we're literally at the final stretch here, which sounds like about two to three hours left of boss, I think that's a good time to pace it, yeah? Y'all, we'll get her next, literally we'll get her next time. I think me stepping away from the game is the best thing that can happen. We'll probably get her like three tries in next time. 
Um, so yeah, I'll get out of the loser rut brain, and I guess until next time. Yeah? <laughs>